I survived 100 days all in hardcore better Minecraft. I adventured these 100 days through a bunch of unique structures, new custom bosses, and even through terrifying dimensions. My goal is to conquer this crazy mod pack by obtaining the most legendary gear, and of course by building a beautiful home featuring tons of new blocks. So sit back, relax, and grab your favorite snack as I try to survive 100 days in better Minecraft hardcore. Well, we're in better Minecraft and it appears to be on the right side. We're in the forested field and wait, I'm literally stuck in a tree right now. I can't do anything. I mean, how do I even get down here without taking any full damage? Look at this place. Oh my gosh, look at those trees over there. They're like red. Okay, well, we need to figure out how to get down here without taking any full damage. Is that even possible? Maybe we can go through here. Okay, well, we actually successfully made it out of the tree. So let's go and explore this place. I hope there isn't any hostile mobs around because that would be really bad. Let me just run over towards this biome over here though. And oh my gosh, I almost just fell down there. That would have been super, super bad. Well, let's go and check this out over here hoping that you know it might benefit us in some way there might be something over here for us oh my gosh there's a raccoon okay well please be friendly little guy i'm not gonna attack you i promise that'd be really silly of me wouldn't it if i did that so i'm gonna get on the good side of this little raccoon behind me oh look at this i can look at all the map here oh my gosh this is huge what is that thing there Oh my gosh. Okay, well, what else can we do here? Oh, there's some quests. Let's check this out. Welcome to Better MC. Okay, to start tutorial, click on this quest. So, oh, what is this? To start the tutorial, click on this quest and read the description. I'm not gonna lie. We haven't got time for all of that, but I have myself three pieces of bread. Well, wow, that's actually pretty useful. Thank you very much, quest book. Do I get any other rewards or like, what is this? Okay, so I have a piece of bread, so then I get three torches now. Oh, oh yes, we have torches now. Let's go. What else can we get from this quest book? Is that it? Is that all of my quests or- Oh, wait, what, what is this? Um, I have a charm. Charm of life, one. Okay, well, I will take that, actually. Thank you very much. Okay, there, I get some XP levels. Nice. Anything else? Oh, look at this. Tutorial complete. Okay, well, let me just check that then. Do I get all of these books? I get an animal dictionary, a network guidebook, and Twilight's flavor and delight guide. First edition. Don't forget that, guys. Well, let me take all three of these then, and that should be the tutorial complete, right? Whoa, look at this. A rainbow birch sapling? What? Well, I don't mind if I do take that. Whoa, look at this thing. I'm definitely going to keep hold of this to grow. Whoa, that'd be super cool. I get, like, rainbow birch trees. Let's check these out then. So we have an animal dictionary so we can, you know, sort of define every single animal we come across. That's pretty cool. So we've got a sunbird here, gorilla, you know, lots of scary mobs in there as well that I do not want to get too close to, I'm not going to lie, especially this grizzly bear. Okay, a network, a guidebook. What is this? Simple storage network will manage all your inventories. See getting started or look up an item. Okay, well, that's pretty useful as well. So that's cool. And what is this? Twilight's flavor. Okay, whoa, that looks cool. Oh my gosh, how do I get this? Enjoy crossover among Twilight Forest, Farmer's Delight, Tricks. What is this? Fiery cooking pot. Okay, whoa. Okay, that is pretty cool. So we'll dive deeper into those things later on, I'm sure. But look at this little thing here, Charm of Life. That's super cool, right? We're going to equip it. Oh my, look at it. We're wearing it. <laughs> we have ourselves a little necklace now. That's super cool. Okay, but I think the most important thing right now is just to collect a bunch of wood. So that's exactly what we're going to go ahead and do, you know. It's just like normal Minecraft, right? But this may be better Minecraft, but, you know, you still got to do normal Minecraft things around here. You're not going to get off easy, you know, without using your hand to chop down lots of wood. Okay, we'll just go ahead and craft this into some oak planks. Let's get a little crafting table down here. Nice. Let's make some sticks and also make ourselves a little axe. I just realized, look at this as well. That is super cool. Okay, well, let's take our wooden axe. And yeah, that's pretty cool. Now it should be a lot easier to chop these trees down. Oh, yeah. That's what we want to see, baby. Give me those oak logs. Come on. We also get some maple saplings as well, which is pretty cool. We can start growing these as well. That's actually super cool. I've just realized we also get some twigs. So I'm not complaining, right? Get more of these oak trees. Oh, nice. That will do it. Oh, yeah. Look how beautiful they look as well. I'm not going to lie. This could actually be used in some of the builds. Maybe get some bushes around here, some red ones. I don't know. It looks super cool in my opinion. Anything lurking in this little ocean here, like this little bit of water? I do see a fish. And what is that? A terrapin. Okay, are you... Can you do any damage to me? I don't know. I'm going to get rid of you just in case because I cannot take any risks on here. I'm not going to lie. So anything I see, I'm just going to absolutely demolish. As harsh as that sounds, I'm sorry. It's true. Oh, my gosh. Look at that thing on the map at the top right. Right, what is that? Is that like a big whale or something? Oh my gosh. I see lots of hostile mobs on the map as well, so I'm kind of scared. i got to be so careful here. Just because I may bump into something that may harm me, I am going to make a little wooden sword, okay? Because, you know, you can never be too safe around here. We're going to head over in this 
direction though see what's sort of happening over here anything interesting whoa is that a little eagle hello eagle oh my gosh wait they oh my no they whoa there's three of you guys no they're taking my bread what is this no no, they've took my bread. Come back. Oh my gosh, they've just eaten my bread right in front of me. Come here. Ugh, no, I need to... Ugh, quick, quick, go up here. Come here. No, why can't I hit you? No, I need you. I think they've just eaten my bread anyway, so honestly, it's quite pointless. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, okay, fair enough. You guys win. Don't worry about it. You know, I'm sure I'll find my own bread elsewhere. Oh my gosh, these eagles, man. It's always the eagles, isn't it? Go out of here. I'll take your feathers. Don't worry about that. You take my bread, I'll take your feathers. How about that? I'm still pretty sad about that. I'm not going to lie. But as you can see, I do think the sun is going down right now. Oh my gosh, the sun is going down and I'm literally stranded right now with no food. I need to find a cow or something real quick. I need to find food ASAP, like literally right now. I'm not going to lie. A little chicken would do just fine. Is there anything around here? I mean, I can't see anything on the map, like, at all. I think I'm just going to head in this direction, though, because I do see, like, a little monument on the map. So I'm going to go ahead and check that out. Oh, no, it's getting super dark. Whoa, look at this place. Oh, my gosh. Okay, wait, can we jump down here? Huh! Oh my god, that was super risky. Go ahead and put this crafting table down real quick. Let's make some more sticks. Okay, we need to make a pickaxe. Okay, let's collect some stone real quick. This is super risky. Please, no mobs attack me. I'm actually begging of you. Oh no, this is super risky. This is so risky. What am I doing? Okay, real quick, let's do this. I'm going to take this iron over here real quick. Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. Yes, there is more than three pieces. Let's go. That will do just fine. Oh no, there's a creeper. Oh no, I'm being approached. Okay, come on, creeper. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, come on, Creeper. Back off, Creeper. I'm trying to survive out here, Creeper, and you're making it super hard for me. Okay, nice. Creeper down. I repeat, Creeper is down. Wait, is there any more iron in this place or not really? Let's collect more cobblestone, though, so we can go ahead and craft ourselves a quick furnace. Therefore, we can smelt this raw iron down into some ingots and craft ourselves a much better pickaxe. Because I'm not going to lie, by the looks of things, we need one. Let me just go ahead and do this. There we go. Pop that down. Uh, can I put twigs in there? No, I can't. Well... Let me just craft myself more sticks real quick. Okay, cool. Well, now we have some iron smelting. You know, not off to a, much of a bad start right now, but it is super dark and scary down here. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to have my torches in my left hand here so I can, you know, kind of see where I'm going. And oh my gosh, what what is this place? Okay, um, this is crazy. Oh my gosh, why is it so bright? It's literally like a luminous baby blue. What are those things? Okay, I need to check that out in just a second, but I need to go ahead and grab some of this smelt iron. Oh, there's some more iron here that I didn't see. Sneaky iron trying to hide, huh? Who do you think you're hiding from? It's definitely not me. That's another piece to add to the collection. There we go. Let's go ahead and craft ourselves a nice iron pickaxe because why not? We have iron to spare, guys. We have iron to spare. Right, let me go ahead and sort this out. Nice. Right, well, let's go ahead and take our supplies real quick. I'm going to take my necessities and head back up to the surface, hopefully finding some food because... Honestly, that is what we need right now. We do need food, like, kind of bad. I'm going to go ahead and collect some more cobblestone, though, while I'm at it, because, you know, why not? Oh, and some coal. There you go. How about that? I love me some coal. Well, I have 13 pieces of coal now, which is actually really useful. So thank you very much, Cole. I uh, I appreciate you, buddy. Right then. We are back to the surface, and we've got to be on our, on our guard. What is that thing? Can we take this? It's not going to spawn anything, is it? Okay, good. What is this? A waystone. Ooh, nice. Oh, that's a quest complete. So do I, do I get something for that, or...? Okay, here's- a that is a spider. That is a spider. Oh my gosh. Okay, come on, spider. Back off, back off, spider. Come on. Oh, there we go. Okay, thankfully, it didn't get any hits on us there, so I'm very thankful for that. Oh, there's a zombie here. Come on, buddy. What do you think you're doing? Come on. There we go. And I can no longer sprint as I have zero stamina. I need to eat really bad. Oh no. Am I heading in the right direction? Yes, I am. I need to head over here, so I'm just gonna- I'm gonna walk there. You know, I have patience, guys. I'm not gonna go ahead and sprint now. Come on. We need to take all of this in, right? <laughs> you know, these lovely views views of these hostile mobs around us. Take it all in, guys. Take it all in. Oh, hello, creeper. Don't mind me, buddy. Do not mind me, buddy. Okay, okay, okay. I get it. I get it. Oh my gosh. Why is there so many mobs? Literally, look at this. I'm being chased. Oh no, this isn't good. Okay, come on. Swim, please. Don't be anything in this water. Oh no. Oh no. I don't know if that can attack me or not. I'm gonna... Oh no. This is bad. Oh no, this is bad. 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 No, 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 no. Run, 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 run. Oh my gosh, I can't even, I can't do anything. I need food so bad. Oh no, please, not like this. Oh my gosh. Help someone, please help. Okay, I need to, oh, man, I need food so bad. I might have to box myself in for a night. I'm not sure. Look at this, I have two arrows sticking out of me. One in my head, one in my arm. This is not good. Do you know what? I'm gonna have to build up. I'm gonna just have to hide up here, I think, honestly. Well, it looks like I'm gonna have to sit up here for a moment. So I'm gonna have to set up camp on top of this tree, this maple tree, and just 
get through this night, honestly. So, I guess I'll see you guys in the morning. A spider just crawled up here and nearly demolished me. I'm literally on one heart now. One arrow to the face and it is all over. At last, the sun is arising. Let's go. Okay, oh, I see a creeper and a skeleton down there and a zombie ready to attack me. But the good news is the sun has risen and we are no longer scared. I repeat, we are no longer scared. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I am pretty scared of the dark. That is music to my ears. Zombies burning from the sunlight. Well, it is a beautiful morning. It's been a rough night on top of this maple tree, but we got through it. So we need to hunt for some food. That is our mission for this morning. We need to hunt for some food very, very badly. I am on literally one heart, so I got to do something here. Honestly, I say we just, we jump down there. What do you guys think? I got to be very strategic about this. Okay. Okay, let's go. Come on, something, fish, anything, please. At this point, I just need anything to cure my hunger, please. That thing looks like it's going to attack me. Oh my gosh. I need anything, just any fish, please. Where are you? Please. I need you like right now. Where is a fish? I can't seem to see one anywhere. Oh, there's some down here. Come on. I just can't swim fast enough. Come on, please. Yes, there we go. Ooh, ooh. Oh my gosh, that scared me. Oh, whoa. Okay, no, 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 no. Go away, go away. You look like you're going to attack me. Oh my gosh. Well, we secured a piece of raw salmon, which is pretty cool. So let's go ahead and smelt this in the furnace right now. Put that down, pop those sticks in, and cook that salmon. Let's go. It only literally regenerates one hunger bar. Are you serious? Well, hey, it's... Oh no, because it's raw, of course. Oh my gosh, I'm so silly. There we go. Three hunger bars. Let's regenerate. There we go. See? That's all we need. Okay, that's all we need. So now let's hunt for more salmon. Where are you, salmon? I see you, salmon. Don't think I can't. Don't think I cannot see you. Buddy? Oh, yes. Oh, 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 no! This fish ate my salmon. No! That catfish, man. Oh, my gosh. Stealing my food. Oh, I need to get that before the catfish does. Come on. There we go. That's another one. And another one here as well. Oh, yes. That's what we like to see. Right, let's go ahead and, and get some more, actually. Why not? Oh, yes. Oh, we are stacked. We are stacked with raw salmon. This is good. Right, let me go and place this down and repeat exactly what I just did. Let's go. Oh, I just remember I have some coal. Oh, my gosh. What am I doing? And in the meantime, while that cooks up, let's go ahead and collect. Oh, well, let's not collect it then. <laughs> what I was going to say is let's click some wood on the way, but it turns out my axe just broke, so i got to make another one. You know the drill now, guys. You know the drill. Boom! There we go. Come on, fall down for me. Let's go. Boom! Oh, yeah. Stack me up with those logs. Oh, give me that salmon quick. Oh, I'm going to eat this. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, yes. That hits the spot. Now we are fully regenerated. Thank the Lord. Okay, well, I need to go ahead and manage my inventory here. Let me go ahead and craft some more oak planks, some spruce logs as well. Why not? And I think that's it for now. What is this we have here? Some green tea leaves. Wow, interesting. Oh, that's very helpful. Full sort inventory. Wow, thank you very much. That is very useful. What does this little terrapin want? Is he staring at my salmon cooking? Well, this isn't yours, buddy. This is mine. No, don't come towards it now. This is mine. This is my salmon. Get, get out of here. This is mine. Swim away and never come back. Well, I'm going to take my furnace and take my trusty crafting table. And I'm going to start heading towards this direction like we was originally supposed to do. You know, until we got stopped by our hunger bars. So now we have zero distractions. No mobs following us. You know, no hunger bars slowing us down. We can start heading towards this direction direction and it is raining. Oh my gosh, these squid look super scary. Look how miserable this is. Oh no. Okay, I gotta swim away. Why is it snowing? What is this? I've been caught in a blizzard. Oh, I need to start heading in this direction, right? Yeah, okay. So if I just go straight down here, then I should be able to reach that little monument thing. I'm yet to see any cows or anything like that though. Oh my gosh, what is this? Okay, this isn't scary at all. Can I go in here? Oh, I see a chest. What's in here? Whoa. Oh my gosh. We found some carrots and bows, some coal, bread. Whoa. Okay, that is that is super cool. I have a I have a leather chest plate. I'm going to go ahead and equip that. Oh yeah, there we go. Some protection there. Okay, we've got to be careful though. Is there anything around here? You know, we've got to be on our guard at all times around here. Is there anything in this thing? Interesting. Well, I'm going to go ahead and, you know, keep heading towards this direction. Yeah, we got quite a bit from that actually, didn't we? So let me go ahead and sort this out. We don't need a spider eye hill and a moss carpet. We don't really need that. We have some rice though. That could come in very useful. I'm going to go ahead and check my quest book, though. You know, have I got anything else? Oh, so I've received an ender pearl and an oak log. Wow. Thank you very much, guys. So kind of you, quest. Oh, dimensions, overworld. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. Okay. Oh, I hear a, a zombie approaching me. So, you know what i got to do? I'm going to take care of some business real quick. There we go. I don't even know what that guy's still doing around here. It's too light for you to be hanging around. Oh, I see some friendly villagers around here. And I see a pig. Well, let's go ahead and head over towards this direction, then. Whoa, look at that thing. Okay. Whoa. Oh, is that a raccoon? Why is there so many raccoons everywhere? Oh my gosh, we have some fishermen. Okay, well, where's the entrance to this place? Might have to break in, I'm not gonna lie. This might be very cheeky of me. Can I come up here? Oh my gosh. Oh, we have a bed. 
We can go ahead and steal this. Might be very cheeky, but what is in this barrel? Oh, okay. We have an end fish, some raw pork chops, raw beef, raw catfish, emerald. Okay. Oh my gosh. A lionfish. We don't want to be eating that thing. And a blobfish. What? No way. Oh my gosh. This place is stacked. We can take these bookshelves. Okay. We have a lot of items to go through here. Oh my gosh. Hello, fisherman. I don't want to seem rude, but honestly, I'm going to have to probably loot you. Look at this little farm they got going on here as well. They got the whole setup. They have literally thought about it all. Look at this place. Oh my gosh. There's an iron golem. Well, I hope that thing doesn't attack me. I come in peace, guys. I promise I come in peace. There's a little lectern here, some more bookshelves, a brewing stand, a wither rose, some paper, some books. Whoa, look at that thing down there. They have like a little camp down there as well. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my gosh. Please do not attack me, Mr. Golem. This place is super cool though. Oh, they're all going to sleep. Shall I go to sleep? Shall I join them? I may as well, right? There we go, guys. Did we all get a good night's sleep? Yeah? I think we all got a good night's sleep, right? Look at the beautiful sunrise. Wow, look at the view they have. That is awesome. You know, it's loot time, guys. I'm sorry, but have you got any good trades for us? Or no, not really. Oh, what, wait, what was that? Loyalty too? Uh, yeah. I mean, we don't really need that. We can take these potatoes though. I'll definitely take that. Some books as well. You know, we can take quite a lot of books actually. So I am going to quickly sneak my way through these books. If that's okay, guys, I apologize, but we may need these later on. And I need a bed as well. Sorry, guys. I know I'm taking all of your stuff, but hey, it will benefit me, guys. I promise. Oh, look at this as well. Lots of wheat. Let's take this bread out and then collect this wheat. I think that'd be the smarter thing to do. Some more coal, some more potatoes. Nice, nice, nice. Some raw cod. Let's take this raw cod then, actually. Oh, a bucket of water. Yeah, we, we can take that. We can take that. Right. Well, let's get this furnace down here for a second. And let's cook those yummy pork chops up. Oh, yeah. Hurry up, though, because I'm getting really hungry out here. There we go. That is much better. I'm going to go ahead and check that out in a second as well. That looks interesting. They got a little campfire going on there. Wait, look at those two raccoons. Are they going to, like, duel each other? They're literally going toe to toe right now. I have no idea what they're doing over there, but I'm just going to leave them to that, I guess. <laughs> Violence is never the answer, guys. Come on now. Unless, obviously, you need to eat and slay a pig for its raw pork chop. And then I'm going to go ahead and cook this raw cod. And while that cooks, I am actually going to go and check that little camp out they got going on here. Let's go ahead and see what they're doing, you know? Oh, no. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. What have I done? What have I done? Please, let me up here. I hate those things. They're so annoying. They phase through walls and stuff, and they do so much damage. I'm not going to lie. I don't think I'm going to even risk that. I'm going to take my food and go. Please do not attack me, please. Maybe I shouldn't go down there and look then. I think that's way too risky. Oh no, I have some potatoes to cook as well. I need some iron golems to protect me right now. <laughs> okay, then I'm going to cook these potatoes. Whoever built this though, fair, fair play. It looks absolutely amazing. Anything else around here? Any interesting builds that catch my eye? Hmm. Well, it hasn't properly loaded in, so I can't really tell, but I'm guessing, honestly, I'm just going to head over in this direction, you know? I'm going to go ahead and explore. Are my potatoes cooking? Yep. To be honest, we want to stay as far as possible from that little place over there because honestly it's very dangerous but, but all of our potatoes are now baked which is really good is there any chests that we've missed let's just double check before we leave this place and leave these little villages to it i guess i think that will do let's take some more books though why don't we how about that oh yeah i'm sorry little buddy but of course he's getting mad he's a little librarian i'm sorry why are you coming at me like that with those little glasses on <laughs> i'm sorry buddy i need your books i don't want to be disrespectful or anything but honestly i really need these i'm sorry i'm gonna get a stack of these books why not then i haven't got to go out my way and farm some paper and, you know, go through all that long process. When I, you know, I've got it all here in front of me. I'm sorry. We've nearly reached a stack already. Okay, just four more books. <laughs> I'm so mean. I've just taken all of their books. I'm so sorry. Hopefully it's none of their favorite books they enjoy reading because that'd be super mean. Hey, whatever I got to do to survive these 100 days, right? But I think it's time to move on from this place now because we've already had some hostile mobs trying to attack us. So let's get rid of this place. You know, let's just go as far as we possibly can. Oh, I think I see some cows on the map. Please. Yes, cows, come here and give me your beef. Nice. Oh, we've got some more cows here. Oh my gosh. Hello, buddy. I'm so sorry, cows. I'm sorry I got to do it to you, buddy, but I need your beef. Look how beautiful this area is. Oh my gosh. Look at these little birds flying around. What is this, a little blue jay? Hello, buddy. This place is so beautiful, honestly. Just take it all in, guys. Take this of you all in. Looks like we're going in some sort of mythical rainforest. I mean, look at this. Well, not necessarily a rainforest, but just a nice mythical kind of forest. I don't know. I like it. It looks really cool. Anything interesting over here by chance? Or what is going on down here? Whoa, look at these little banana slugs. What do you drop? Do you drop anything in particular or... Oh, what can I do with this slime? Well, our sword broke, which is not good. Have we got any more iron left over? We do. Should we craft ourselves a little iron sword real quick? Would that be wise? Well, we've done it regardless because why not, right? We need to protect ourselves out here because we have no idea what these little forests hold. There could be some seriously dangerous creatures living out here, guys. 
Ow! And not necessarily a creature, but a little... Oh my gosh, what even is that? Even these little berry bushes do damage. So we've got to be careful of literally everything now. Even a little bush. We've got to be careful. So careful out here. But how about we go mining? I think that'd be wise. Should we go and do some mining? Oh my gosh. Oh, there's lots of kelp down here as well. Should we go and take some of this up? We can use this as fuel. So let's take some of this kelp up real quick. Oh! Hello, buddy. What have you... You've just given me orcas might? Well, thank you very much. I, uh, I appreciate that. Ow, I'm taking damage, though. I'm sorry. I can't go down there for too long, buddy. Why, thank you very much, Orca. Thank you very much. So kind of you. I'm going to collect all of this kelp while I can. Super good for fuel source. And it's becoming nighttime again. So honestly, I think we're just going to go mining. What do you guys think? I say it's a wise idea. Let's go ahead and just dig a little spiral staircase, like so. And let's go down here. I'm going to block this off, actually. So, you know, just in case anything comes down here, like a creeper, for example, that would be really bad. So I'm just going to go ahead and put a little block down there. Come on, I want to come across something interesting. Okay, what is this? Is there anything in here? I'm gonna go down here. Oh, there is a creeper. Of course there's a creeper. I mean, why wouldn't there be, right? Why wouldn't there be a little creeper lurking down this cave waiting for me? I mean, make it make sense, guys. Come on. Oh, what is this? Oh, so we've stumbled across a little cave here. Okay, this is good. This is what we need. I see iron, and I'm going to take it. Why has an army of skeletons just spawned in? Okay. Can I collect this without you guys seeing me? Is that possible? Okay, quick. What do I drop? Feathers. There we go. There is a skeleton. I repeat, there is a skeleton. I'm going to block myself in. Oh my gosh, i got to be super careful down here. I'm just going to dig straight down until I enter another cave again. Oh, it appears to be we found something. Oh my gosh, there's a bunch of lava. That looks a huge cave. Do I see diamonds down there? Oh, I see diamonds, baby. I gotta mine these blocks with caution as I might fall down and take a lot of fall damage. Okay, we gotta be careful about the mobs here as well. Don't forget about that. I need to make a shield. I might do that real quick, actually. Yeah, let me go ahead and do that. Let me go and smelt some of this raw iron. And I'm gonna make myself a shield because I need one really, really bad. Especially if I'm gonna go hunting down in this little cave. Imagine how many mobs I'm gonna stumble across. I definitely need something to protect myself. Look how much iron is around this place though oh my gosh it's packed this is juicy there's a lot of stuff here we need can this spider climb up here because you know what these spiders are like they can literally climb up anywhere so i've got to be very careful right let's get this crafting table down like this and let's make a little shield okay it's like this isn't it like a y and then iron up here okay finally oh my gosh i forgot how to craft a shield what is going on here i'm gonna put that just here okay i'm gonna i'm gonna take this now actually i might as well just yeah there we go okay well let's be very careful then but we now have a shield we can protect ourselves Gotta be careful for this little spider down here. I know what these little guys are like. We've made it. We're in the cave. Okay. Yeah, we gotta be super careful. Oh my gosh. Oh no. No, 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 no. Run, 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 run. Oh my gosh. These skeletons have aimbot. What is that? Look at this place. Oh my gosh. This is zombie trying to sneak up on us right now. Get out of here, zombie. Do not hit me, though. I see these diamonds down here, though. i got to go for it, bro. i got to go for these diamonds. Okay, I'm gonna sneak down here. Minding my own business like usual. What is that? Oh my... What is that? Okay, I'm going to ignore that, I guess. And I'm just going to take my diamond. Oh, oh, two diamonds. Oh, there we go, baby. We have, we're collecting these diamonds now. We've got two diamonds. Lots of iron down here as well. But I feel like our main target down here is honestly to collect as much diamonds as we possibly can. Iron, you know, it's very easy to obtain. But diamonds, on the other hand... Oh, I see some more talking about diamonds. Oh, my gosh. Let's go, baby. Was that another diamond I saw or was it one of these little squids? Was it that little glow squid? I'm not sure. I think it was, actually. I've, I've been baited, I think. Oh, there, there's diamonds over here. Okay, let's get by these skeletons. Oh, my gosh. Oh, they're battling it out. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Okay, you've proved yourself, but unfortunately, you need to get slain. And you, zombie. Don't think you can just sneak up on me as well. Don't be third party in, bro. Come on, that's that's bad. A little creeper here. Can we get a little hit? Ooh, run. Diamonds, come to me. Look at these little pots here. Do they drop anything? Ooh, golden nuggets. I don't really need those, though. I need to explore this cave and see what's lurking. Look at that, though. We have five diamonds on our hands. Oh, gosh, there's more zombies. Can we get around these guys? Yep. Don't mind me, guys. Do not mind me. I'm coming through. Passing through. I mean, no harm. Is there anything deeper in these caves? Let's find out. Okay, nothing down there. Dead end. Ooh, what is that? Is that a diamond? Yep, that is another diamond. What is that? What is that thing? Can someone please tell me in the comments what that thing is, please? Because it's very scary. Like, really scary. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna eat my cooked salmon. Okay, I'm super scared. How do I get out of here? What is that? We need to head in this direction. I gotta go and check that thing out, whatever that is. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Okay, come on, Skelly. We can talk things out. Oh, please. Huh. Okay, there we go. Oh my gosh. Is that underground or overground? I think that's underground, right? Oh, the more diamonds. Okay, actually, we might have to leave those because there's too many mobs around. Okay, let's keep heading towards this direction then. Oh, more diamonds as well along the way. 
Oh my gosh, what is this thing? I have no clue, but we're about to go and check it out over here in the overworld and then maybe dig down to it, maybe? It was roughly about here, right? So if we just go over here and then dig down, we might be able to go ahead and find out what it is. <laughs> Let's go and explore it. You're my sunflower. Okay, we've got to be close now, right? It's got to be somewhere towards here. I feel like we should dig down approximately here. What do you think? This looks pretty good, right? Oh, there's a little entrance here. Yeah, it's a sign. Let's just dig straight down. Obviously not directly straight down because that is really risky and you should never ever do that in Minecraft, but... We're going to dig down and see what it is. I also hear some very spooky noises, so I'm uh, I'm intrigued. I'm very intrigued right now. Come on. My pickaxe has just broken. Brilliant. I think that means I need to go ahead and craft myself a diamond one then. What do you think? Yep, there we go. Oh yeah, look at that. Show me this spooky cave. Come on, I'm not afraid of you anymore. There's some granite down here. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Oh, oh my gosh. I was about to dig down there as well. Where is this thing? Oh, we're so close. It's right here. Okay, I'm so excited yet so scared at the same time. Whoa, what is this? Oh my gosh, wait, what have I just stumbled across here? Whoa, oh my gosh. Okay, wait, is there anything interesting in here? Some more coal? Whoa, look how much wheat is in here. That is stacked. I'm gonna take all of that good stuff. Oh yeah. Okay, anything else interesting in here? Oh, little picture frame here and a little bed. Looks very comfortable if I do say so myself. Very cozy in here. Oh, look at this up here as well. Oh, I hear a spider. Well, it seems to be that I've stumbled across some obsidian, so I'm guessing the place is down here. Oh my gosh, why is there so much obsidian? What? What is this? Is this like a nether in the overworld? Oh, we've reached something here. What is this? Oh my gosh. I hear blazes. What? What is this place? No way. It's like a nether in the overworld. What? What? What is this place? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Well, we've definitely hit something here. Okay. I gotta be, I gotta be super careful. These blazes, man, they mean trouble. These guys stand on business. I gotta be so careful here. That's what I'm trying to strategically mine down here. Oh, I wonder what's in there. Why is there so many blazes though? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Okay. Chill out, chill out, chill out. We're fine, we're good, we're good. You know, we're just burning, but it's fine. We'll eat our carrot in peace. That's fine, let's regenerate some hearts. It's no biggie, guys. Come on, they're just some blazes now, aren't they? Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. This is really dangerous, and we may not be prepared for this, but we're willing to take the challenge. Oh my gosh, I need to go for that chest. I gotta go see what it's in there. You guys ready? Can we do this? I don't know. We're gonna have to get our shield out right now, though. Yeah, we can't take any risks. I need to light this place up a little bit, though. Huh! Oh no, there is a magma as well. What? Oh my gosh, that is super stacked. Bro, what? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh no, 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 no. I'm super low. I'm super low. Go, 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 go. Oh my gosh. Did you guys see what was in that chest? That was super stacked. Okay, we've got to be so careful. I'm pretty sure our charm just ran out there as well. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, what is that? Oh no, we need to go for that chest. Okay, these blazes literally mean, they mean chaos. I don't know if I'm quite ready for this cave yet. Honestly, I feel like I need to have that chest. I can't leave here being empty handed now, can I? I've got to take some memorabilia with me. Oh my gosh. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, uh, no, 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 nothing in there. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, nice. Anything in this one? Oh my gosh. No way. We are so stacked. Look at this fire protection too. I don't mind if I do. Diamond chest plate. Yes, please. What is this? Diamond gloves? What? Okay, it has curse of binding on it though. That is the only thing, but I mean, I don't know what they do. When on hands, plus zero. 0.75 attack damage. Okay, well, I'm gonna keep them just there for now. You know, I'll think about it, but oh my gosh, we managed to obtain some diamond armor and a lot of diamonds. There's blazes everywhere. No, 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 no. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, honestly, I'm thinking of just getting out of here. I've took some loot and honestly, I'm quite happy with it. I think we should come down here in more preparation because honestly, I don't think we're prepared. It is way too dangerous down here. I am not going to lie. Okay, this is really, really dangerous. Honestly, I mean, look at that. How can you even come down here? Whoa, netherite ingot. Okay, I'll definitely take that. Okay, zombie. I know, I get it. I get it. You know, we all want hugs. Oh my gosh. Whoa, what is this? Wait, there's more to it? Whoa, look at this thing. Oh my gosh, baby zombie. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, please, please. Nothing come behind me now, please. I'm gonna eat my baked potatoes. Okay, what is down here? Some amethyst? What's around here? Anything interesting? Or... Oh my gosh, what even is this place? What do you even call this? All I know is that it's super interesting. Okay, Oh, no. Is that Blaze? Please not again. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. Well, that's a wrap. Oh, my gosh. Wait, they're attacking the skeletons. What? I think we've done enough exploring down here for the meantime, and I have an arrow in my head. Wow, how nice. I see the light. Wait, is that lava? Oh, my gosh. Well, that was close. Okay, finally, we've reached the surface. I've never been so happy in my life to go ahead and see some biomes around here. And that, like, 
Never Cave or whatever that was down there. Honestly, was really, really scary. So, Chicken, where are you? I know you're around here somewhere. There you are. Don't think I can't see you lurking in the shadows. Ooh, what is that little structure over there? Some sort of bridge or something? Hello, horsey. How are you doing, buddy? You enjoying this view? Eating some grass? Just chilling, guys. Just chilling. There's another one over here as well. Oh, hang on. There's another one as well. There's three horsies up here. Ooh, look at these cows. Wait, can I lift these cows up? Wait, if I unequip my shield, can I... Oh my god. Oh my gosh. I've got the cow. I've captured the cow. Okay. Um, what do I even do with you now? Wow. I never thought I'd uh, be doing this. I'll, uh, I'll put you down. You can join your friends actually, but I might need some beef. So I'm sorry about this cow. I'm really sorry, but this is what I have to do for survival. Where did the other one go? Is it over here? Yeah. Come here, buddy. Don't think you can escape me. There we go. Okay, nine pieces. That's pretty decent, actually. I'm pretty sure we can make a backpack as well, right? Ooh, so I need six pieces of rabbit hide and an iron ingot and two strings. So, I mean, I have leather. Can I not do it with leather? Has it got to be rabbit hide? Oh, look at these blue jays. Oh, no, that's a hummingbird. My bad. I thought there was blue jays. Hmm, is there anything around us here that looks interesting? Okay, that catches my eye. I have no idea what that thing is. Should I go over and check it out? I have no idea what this is. Oh, I almost fell down there. Hello, spider. I don't think I didn't see you down there. Okay, I need to eat some cooked cod real quick. I'm getting so hungry out here. Wow. Ooh, some sugar cane. Okay. I wonder what's over here. Is this another catfish? Hello, catfish. Hope you are having a great day. Lots of lilac around. Pretty nice. Well, what's this on fire over here? Is this another lava pit or something? Oh my gosh, wait, what is this? Whoa, okay, how do I get up here? Okay, what is that? Oh my gosh. What is this place? Okay, well, this isn't creepy at all. Is there anything around it, though, or is there anything underneath or any- Oh, haha, there's a chest. What's in this chest? Seriously, a golden sword. I thought there would have been something interesting, I'm not gonna lie. Well, there is nothing. It's just a soul campfire above the chest with a literal golden sword in it. Not even anything interesting. Well, that's kind of sad. There's a little bee's nest here. I won't uh, interrupt you guys. What is that? A Tasmanian devil. Okay. Oh, it looks like he's about to jump or something. Oh my- Oh my gosh. You guys are so fast. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay, okay. I get it, I get it. Oh my gosh. Okay, note to self. Do not touch a Tasmanian devil, because those things are quite lethal. Whoa, look at this down here. Oh my gosh. Gosh. Guys, take this all in. Oh, I want to go over here. Yeah, this looks cool. Ah, uh, there's a sneaky zombie. Of course. There's always that one, right? Wait, have we already been here? Is this the place we previously checked out? Yeah, it is. It is. We've already been here. We need to start looking into building a base as well, because I'm not going to lie. We need a safe place around here, because there is so many hostile mobs around us, including this drown under here. I mean, just look at it. La, 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 la. Do I still have that bed? Oh, I do. Maybe I can go to sleep. Yeah, that would be wise, wouldn't it? Okay, there we go. Let me take this bed and now it's daytime again hooray oh let's go towards this thing over here so where is it over over here right okay back from where we came from look at this that is super cool should we go and check it out is there any interesting loot in here oh hello little guy Heidi where are you going I'm not gonna attack you bro don't worry about it oh an adventurer's guide the gatekeeper this item only needs to be used once well I mean I can I can get it so should we check it out and see what it does let's open this whoa the blue journal unlocked in your tab inventory check your tab oh Whoa, what is this? Um, whoa, these are all different portals. Everbright portal, Everdawn portal, and what is this? General. Okay, well, there's nothing on here, so. Okay, that's very interesting. Thank you, Heidi. Thank you for your trade. I appreciate that. But let's go ahead and go in here real quick. Oh, they got the whole cozy setup going on in here. Got some smokers. Oh, they got some charcoal. Might take that. Oh, they have more emeralds in here. Have they got anything yet? More charcoal. Okay, well, this is very interesting. What is that thing over there? Oh, this is like a little bridge, right? A very broken bridge, though. What is what is this? Oh, there's some more bridges over here. Let's head towards this direction. Lots more sugar cane here for you sugar cane lovers. I might actually start taking that. I'm going to get rid of those spawner fragments and actually take the sugar cane because I am going to need it. So what is with all these bridges around here? Oh, what is that through here? What is that? Okay, I need to go and check that out. <laughs> Serious parkour by scoops there. Whoa, look at this place. Oh no, there's more pillagers. Oh no, 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 no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, please. So I know you guys deal serious damage. What? How did you just hit me? I'm going to head back in this direction. Go towards that house again where my little friendly villager was. I need to go and use that smoker. But oh my gosh, look at that cave. Let me up. Oh no, I see a grizzly bear on the map in the top right corner. This is not good. Villager, help. I'm being attacked by pillagers. Please help. Just let me cook my beef. That's all I ask. Cook for me, please. I'm so hungry out here. Oh, quick, come to me. Nom, nom, nom. Okay, there we go. 
Thank you. Oh, I didn't see this bit. Aha, uh -huh, that's very hidden. I'll go and check that out in just a second. Anything up here? Okay, can I get rid of this? A moonstone. Actually pretty cool. I want to take this. Whoa, what is this? Ominous woods? Frozen ocean? Yeah, we're definitely heading this direction. That's for sure. That looks very interesting. Take my pork chops and my charcoal, and I'm going to head out for an adventure. It is becoming nighttime again, though, so I may need to pop this bed down and go to sleep again. Oh, no, no, no. That's a grizzly bear. Look at it. Oh, no. Okay, that's much better. Whoa, look at that over there. We're definitely checking that out soon. What is that, a little igloo? Okay, well, let's check out this ominous forest. I see lots of grizzly bears on the map. I'm not gonna lie. This looks very dangerous. Oh, my gosh. Those guys do not look like they want to cuddle. I'm not gonna lie. They look cuddly, but they're probably not. So, I don't want to take any risks here. Look at them. There's a whole family of them. I wonder what they look like. Let's see. Whoa. Okay, that is cool. That is super cool. Oh, my gosh. Okay, yeah, we're definitely... Definitely taking these. Okay, let me go and put this crafting table down. Make a little axe. So I'll collect as much as this as possible then. Probably get a whole stack of this stuff. Okay, can I set a waypoint around here? I'm going to call it the urban woods. So I'm going to set a little waypoint here now. Okay. Okay, I don't know why I've spelt woods wrong, but let me just edit that. Okay, there we go. So now we have a little waypoint set. We can see where the urban woods is. What is that? What? Oh, the wither rose. Oh my gosh, that is a wither rose, isn't it? Yeah. Those urban planks are super cool though. I can't wait to use those in my build. What is that? Oh my gosh. Ow, ow, these wither roses, what? Okay, you guys gonna hurt me? I don't know, but let's uh, test that theory. Oh, you guys are so scary though. Ah, Orca, what are you doing? Okay, what is this? Why is there a floating island up there? What, what is that? Are these seals? <laughs> no way, <laughs> look at these guys. Ah, oh, poor guys look so tired. I'm scared that something's gonna come up behind me. Oh my gosh, look at that thing. Whoa, oh my gosh, that is huge. I think it was like a big whale of or some sort. I don't know. That looks super scary, though. So I'm going to make some leggings and some boots. Okay, nice. There we go. So now we are fully diamond armor. Nice. There's lots of drowns down here as well. That's one thing I've noticed. What's with the floating islands, though? What's up there, I wonder? Well, take a look at this, then. How beautiful does this look? My little fellow hummingbirds around me. And I do see a house over there as well. So it'd be rude not to go ahead and check this out, wouldn't it? There's lots of bamboo everywhere. And this is blossom as well. Oh, some cherry log. Whoa, look at that. Oh my gosh. I'm going to take these cherry saplings though because I want to use these around my own build because I think they just look so nice so I'm just going to keep the saplings for now and not the actual logs trust me I know what I'm doing I think Oh no, I need to place this bed down again. There we go. That's much better. Oh no, there's a skeleton approaching me. Oh no. Let's approach this house then. See what's around here. Whoa, what is this? A little Sheba? Ah, hello buddy. I'll leave you alone though. I'm probably bothering you guys. Oh, there's a spider. Hey, you look familiar. Janice? Is that how you pronounce that? Janice? Janice? I'm not quite sure, but what I do know is, and I'm going to enter your lovely home here, you have some leather gloves. See, the thing is with these, I can't take these off, but these ones? Nah, I'll leave it. What else have you got in here for me? Nothing? Okay. Oh, hey, it was worth exploring. Oh, wait. Aha, a little secret thing you got going on here, Jenny's. Let's go up here. What's in here then? Nothing, just bread. Oh, wait. Aha, more wheat. And more of these moonstones, which I will definitely take. I can use them for lighting in my own home. A lavender forest. Interesting. What do you think? Should we start building a home around here? We'll go and check this forest out and then we can start building a home. I think that's the wise thing to do here. Whoa, look at these hills though. It's another little Sheba. Hello, buddy. Aha, this is what I need. I need you guys. Give me your beef. I'm going to sacrifice one piece of steak. Oh, there's definitely lots of cows around here. Oh my gosh. Whoa, this looks super cool. I think I'm going to build my house around here. Ouch. Just because how cool these lavender trees look. Whoa, look at these. Jacaranda log. Okay, well, these are super duper cool. What do these look like? Whoa, they're white. That's so nice. Oh my gosh. Are those crocodiles? No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Okay, I'm definitely not diving in there. That scared me. Oh my gosh. I was wondering, what is that thing? I thought it was like a little frog or something, but no. It's a little crocodile. It's not little. It's it's huge. Oh no. I'm getting away from there. No way am I entering that side. Okay, what do you think? Set up camp around here? What is that noise? Yeah, I might start building a house around here, honestly. What do you guys think? Yeah, I might do that. Hmm. Maybe I should flatten out some land 
land along here then. So let me make a crafting table real quick. Right, like that. And then let's make some chests here. Right, so we can go ahead and put these down. So now what we can do is we can go ahead and store everything in here that we don't need on us. Well, that's a lot easier, isn't it? And I feel like I'm going to flatten out some land up here, maybe. Yeah, so maybe flatten all of this part out. I think that would be the, the wise idea. So let me hit the crafting table real quick. Make some sticks. And I might have to make quite a few shovels. Well, let me make two for now. See how we get on with that. And let's just go ahead and flatten this all out. And of course, I get interrupted by a creeper. Oh my, I'm trying to mind my own business. Oh my gosh, that is super scary. I've been caught in a thunderstorm while trying to do a little build here. Wait, what is this down here? Oh, I hear zombies though. Oh, oh my gosh. I've stumbled across a spawner. Wait, this is perfect. What the? This is like a natural XP farm. No way. We have our very own XP farm down there, so that's pretty useful. Well, I guess I'm going to have to dig out down this side then. While digging this space out, I'm just trying to think what I'm going to actually put in my base. Obviously, I need, you know, the necessities like a food farm and sustainable tree farm and all that good stuff. Actually, to be fair, we don't really need a tree farm looking behind us, but you know what I'm trying to say. You know, we need an animal farm, some pigs, some cows, chickens even, which I I do see a lot of cows around me actually over here so uh, uh, get in there i've got my cow you've been captured i want to go and get this cow as well i don't think you can escape come here haha <laughs> you've been captured as well don't worry i'll get you guys some torches so you're not scared of the dark it's fine i'm just gonna cook some beef as well while i'm at it i've got you torches i'm coming don't worry there we go is that better for you I could do with lighting this place up a little bit, though. Okay, well, let's just crack on with this then, I guess. It's starting to come together now, actually. It's looking like we're progressing here, honestly. Before you even know it, we've cleared out quite a lot of land, so I'm very happy with that. It's all starting to come along now. Oh, my gosh, and there's zombies trying to escape. What on earth? Come on now, guys. I'm busy here. Do you not see? Come on, so rude. Okay, so now we have all this land to work with. So the most important thing is that it's all flat as well, so we can build absolutely anything we want to build. But, I mean, we've got to plan this out. I mean, what are we going to use? You know, what materials are we going to use? Where are we going to build it? Which way is it going to be facing? What are we going to put where? That's what we've got to figure out, right? So I think we should build a nice looking house approximately here in the middle, maybe. Then maybe build a little carrot potato farm over here. Then put the animal farm over here. We'll, uh, we'll figure it all out, but I might have to push this back just a tad. Maybe about here. So if I dig this dirt here in a straight line, it should give me just a little bit more space to work with. I'd rather be too much than not enough, you know? So so that's what I'm just going to do here. Just dig this out. There we go. All right. Well, we have lots of land to work with now. So let's get to work. Ah, little wandering trader. How are you? What trades do you have to offer as well? That's the most important thing. By the looks of things, not a lot. Pathfinder's quill. Hmm. Yeah, honestly, you don't have a lot for me, George. Spelt of a J. Who's called George Spelt of a J? Is that a real thing? I'm not sure. Well, thank you very much, George. To get started with the build of my house, I went out and gathered the materials I needed. This consisted of cobblestone, stone, and a lot of jacaranda logs. Whilst doing my tasks, I thought I'd go and check on my beautiful cows. Aren't they just adorable? I also stumbled upon a mysterious floating sheep. Hmm... Thereafter, I came back to base and planted some saplings down so it was easier to obtain wood. Whilst going back and forth between chopping down trees and replacing the saplings, I continued extending the land out by a couple more blocks. I started feeling a little peckish and these cows were looking pretty tasty, so I grabbed my sword and collected some raw beef. While I wandered around the enchanted forest, a pillager camp caught my attention. I went ahead and checked it out and I found a chest with some pretty decent loot. But I wasn't going to be let off the hook too easy. I was attacked by bows and had to put up a fight. But then my sword broke. But luckily it happened just in time. So I grabbed my emeralds and made a run for it. But now I had what I needed to get started. I proceeded to begin the build. Okay, so first thing is first. As you can see on the outside, I placed some jacaranda logs. So they're going to be used as pillars and they'll be raised in just a second. Second, but I've just taken out some dirt of the floor and I'm going to replace this with some umbran planks because I just think I look about good so I'm just going to fill this all the way in and then once I've filled this in I'm going to start raising the pillars a little bit so I sort of know where I'm going and as you can see I've made a little dirt path around it so this is where I'm going to place some like cobblestone and stone and stuff basically used for the walls so that's what that's for one two I'm going to raise these up by two more so that's three on the left side and then this one I'm going to raise a little bit more so one two three four five so that's now five blocks high I am going to take some full damage every time I fall down so don't mind that it's only a heart don't worry about 
about that. I'll just regenerate real quick. But okay, this is what it's looking like. So these two at the back, sorry, these three on the side, are three blocks high and these ones are five. And you'll see why in just a second. But I'm going to keep raising these pillars up. It's becoming nighttime again. So I do think I'm actually going to go to sleep real quick. Okay, much better. So now we don't have to worry about any hostile mobs coming up behind us, especially creepers, because we don't want creepers coming up behind us right now. That wouldn't be good. By the way, I just absolutely love the look of these jacaranda logs. I think they look so cool. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to connect these ones at the back. So I'm just going to come along like so. Okay, so I'm just going to come this side now and connect it around this side. And then all I've got to do now is just connect it all the way around, pretty much. Come along like this. And then finally... Oh my gosh, wait, what is this? Oh my gosh, where are these guys came from? They've come from the pillager camp. Oh no, they've finally come back to haunt me. I knew they wouldn't let me off the hook so easy. They've came back for revenge. Look at this guy. Oh my gosh, I do not want to be getting in the way of that axe. Okay, come on. Why is there so many of you guys? Marauder, go away, please. Come on, pillager, you can have it as well. There we go. Is that all of you guys or is there more? Please don't tell me there's more because I don't want any more distractions whilst building this house. Look at that axe in the wood. What is going on? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Who's that behind me? Come on now, buddy. Oh my gosh. Give me a break. Okay, well now I got a bad omen. So that's great, isn't it? It's only for an hour and 40 though, but to get rid of this, I'm probably just going to go ahead and craft myself a quick bucket, get some milk and cleanse it so it's no longer there. So that is exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to head over to my friendly cows, collect some milk, drink it and then I should have that bad omen off of me. And there we go. That is much better. I feel absolutely perfect now. I haven't got to worry about no bad omens on my case, so that's good, I guess. But now there's no distractions. Let's continue with the build. Okay, so now we're going to start filling out the walls with some stone. So let's just fill this in here, and then I'm going to do the same at this side. So this is actually going to be the side entrance, so don't mind that for now. Follow it around the top and then around the side. Okay, boom, there we go. So we got this side done. Okay, so now let's build it up this side. We'll block all this side off now. And then afterwards, I'm pretty sure we're just going to mine a bit and then follow it up with some cobblestone as well to like blend in so it's not all just stone we just want it to look cool i feel like if it's all stone it won't look as good so see look if it's just stone i mean it doesn't really look as good but follow it up with a little bit of cobblestone in there i'm sure it'll look a much better i'm gonna go ahead now and craft some jacaranda slabs like so nearly two stacks that will do the trick all i've got to do now is build up a little bit and then follow it around with some slabs well first of all i'm gonna grab some normal planks and then fill that in there all i've got to do now is fill the middle of the roof in with slabs so that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm just going to come up here like that. Now I've got all the roof done. I'm going to come up a little bit more like this. So then I'm going to come up higher in the middle here. And then all I'm going to do now is just strip the logs. Like so. Look how cool that looks. I actually really like the look of these jacaranda logs. Especially when they're stripped. And then I'm just going to do the same this side as well. So, you know, we're all symmetrical here. Looks pretty good to me. And then I'm going to do the exact same thing, just the opposite side. Just making sure this is all level here. I'm just going to go ahead and strip these logs now. I need to go one more up, I believe. So that's just what I'm going to go quickly fix. There we go. So now that's all done. But let me go down and make some Umbran stairs. These will be used for the roof. So I'm just going to craft a bunch of these. I'm just going to place a stair down here. Oops, not like that. There we go, facing upwards. Then I'm going to place an Umbran plank there. And I'm just going to follow up with some more stairs. So this is currently what it's looking like. And I'm going to follow up the exact same the other side. Okay, and there we have it. It's all connected up now. So that looks pretty good to me. But now it's time to start filling the roof actually in. So I'm going to come along like this. This, making sure it's nice and symmetrical like always because we don't want an odd roof now do we i'm gonna place a trap door here oh no wrong way hold up a second this side there we go just all extra detail to the roof oh my gosh creeper what are you doing here come on buddy i'm busy with this roof can't you see there we go oh my gosh creeper so rude so as you can see this is sort of where i'm going with it so this will be the front of my house on the right side it's all done so i'm going to go back up top and go finish off the left side okay so there we go the front now is complete okay well it appears to be that we've run out of some urban planks and stairs and etc so we're out of this material right now so that means we have to go back to the urban woods farm some more of this 
stuff and then we can continue it. But what do you guys think so far? Are we liking it? Is it unique enough for you guys? I think when it's all put together, I think it actually will look pretty cool. I don't know. What do you think? I think it matches in with the whole, you know, purple around here, the whole lavender theme. I quite like it. So let me know down in the comment section down below. Do you guys like this or not? Let me know down below. Well, lucky me. On my way, I found yet another ominous forest and that means more urban logs. So I haven't got far to go at all, which is pretty useful here. I'm going to collect these saplings as well. So I haven't got to go out of my way. I'm just keep planting these things. Okay. Well, that is an absolute lifesaver then. That isn't far away from my home at all. It's only 417 meters away. It's very helpful. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Saved me going all the way over there. 2,600 meters away. That is for sure. Oh yeah. Give me these urban logs. Oh no, not you zombie. What the? Well, you got my sapling. Give me that. What do you think you're doing, buddy? Okay. That should be honestly enough now. Okay. So panic over then. Whoa. What is this? Oh my. Wait, what is this? An old railway track by the looks of things. Oh, and a chest. Nice. So with some emeralds in, I'll uh, definitely be taking those. These zombies need to seriously mind their own business. What? And I'm being shot now. Okay, I'm being being arrowed. Ah, there you are. And fully golden armor? You came prepared. Uh-oh. Okay, there we go. And another zombie. Just to top things off, you know. Why not? I've got to go and check this thing out, though. Is there anything else down here? Or is, is this it? Yeah, I think this is just it, to be honest. Pretty cool, though, right? I didn't see this here. But like I mentioned, thank you, Urban Logs, for being so close to me. I really appreciate the ominous forest. Am I pronouncing that right? Is it ominous? Om, om, do you know what? I give up, but you guys know what I'm trying to say. So I'm going to go back to my base if I can without being attacked. Obviously not. Okay, I'm just going to make a run for it, honestly. If I just dodge all of these mobs, hopefully I can get home very safely and go to sleep in my nice, comfortable bed away from these mobs. Oh, no, no, no. There's so many. Why is there so many zombies? I'm so happy that those urban logs are only literally right around the corner from my actual base. So helpful. Saved me traveling absolutely ages. It, that has just saved me so much time. Honestly, I'm, I'm going to keep it real with you guys. That has just absolutely saved me so much time. So I'm very thankful for that. But I'm close to home now. If I can get down here, okay. I hear a skeleton. I'm going to go down here. Oh my gosh, this guy is... This guy means business. What? Leave me alone, buddy. But we are back to base. We have reached our home once again. It's coming along pretty nicely now. You know, we're going to finish off this roof here. Get the main bits done. Then we can just start decorating, you know, adding doors, lanterns, all that good stuff, right? But I need to get rid of these creepers first. I know, Creeper. I know, buddy. I know. Now i got to jewel off with this skeleton because I need to go to sleep. Like, really bad. Ah, uh, that's much better. I've reached my home. I've got what I need. And I'm ready to build and start off the day. Boom. Boom. And boom. Okay, so now the back should look exactly like the front. Yeah, I think I've nailed it. I think it looks very similar. Follow the top of the roof now. Nice. Now I've got to just follow the exact same thing the other side and place some upside down jacaranda stairs. Time to implement the chimney. But I just realized we need to go ahead and craft ourselves some cobblestone walls. So let me quickly just do that. There we go. Oh no, didn't mean that. Okay, this right here is going to be a little tower for upstairs. And you'll see what I mean. Time to put the roof on it. Voila. Oh my gosh, I'm definitely going to melt in this sun. More fences. Top the tower off, then follow the sides up with some more umbran planks. Okay, time to decorate. Hey, we got some lighting now. It's starting to come along pretty nicely now. These jacaranda trapdoors just look beautiful. Yeah, also the signs look really nice. I'm starting to like it. The lanterns give off a nice cozy ambience as well. But I am getting pretty hungry, so I'm sorry about this, cows. A guy's got to eat out here. Oh, that hits the spot. I'm going to insert some ladders in here for easy access. There we go. Now I can see what's going on in the world. Okay, so after a long day's work, or actually maybe a couple days of grinding, you know, coming back and forth, collecting different sort of materials and coming back. Well, let me just show you where we are at currently. It's a little bit hard to sprint, so please do not mind that for a moment. But here we go. What do you guys think? I think it looks absolutely cool. Honestly, I really like it. What do you guys think? I think I made good use out of the... By the way, I kept calling these urban planks. They're called umbran. Umbran? Umbran planks? I didn't mean to pronounce them that way, but I thought I used a good use of the Umbran 
Umbran planks, if I can pronounce them correctly, my bad. And also the jacaranda planks, with also the logs and a little bit of stripped wood there, here and there. What do you guys think? I got like a little tower going on here. This is the front entrance. I'll show you around the side. Got some barrels here, some lanterns going on, some buttons on here for extra detail. Little lantern over here as well. What do you guys think? I think it suits this little lavender field just perfectly. And obviously this isn't it. I have to put like a little barn here maybe for like a horsey. Put an animal farm around here, sustainable food farm. And I've got to decorate the place up a little bit as well because I can't just have it looking like this, right? It's got to be looking a little bit better than this. But what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comment section below. I'll give you a little tour inside as well, but I just thought I'd show you the outside, the little exterior. Oh, I'm getting shot at by a skeleton. Where is that? I have no idea, but there's its arrow. Well, let me go show you around then. So as you can see, you come into here. This is the entrance. This is the little kitchen area. So I'm thinking of putting like a smoker here, with like a little campfire underneath it to give it that effect that it's actually smoking. This is the little expelair, I think it's called. It's supposed to look like it anyways with the smoker there. But then I'm going to put something here as well. Got some barrels going on up here. So maybe I can store some food in these barrels. So it's all organized. I got a little chest going on here. So maybe I can put some things that I don't need, but that could come in useful in this chest. Then if we head up these ladders here, which I think look pretty cool, we go up into the attic. And then as you can see, we've got a little table here. Maybe put a flower pot on here later on. Another storage chest. Come down here, you have a little sitting area. So, you know, it just looks pretty cool. You can have a look outside, see what's going on. And then this is the bedroom. I'm yet to put something here. Put a little loom there because it just looks cool. A little lantern above here as well. And then if you come in here, here we have a little storage room. Oh, my bad. A little storage room for some valuables. So if I want to put some diamonds in here, some emeralds, iron, all that good stuff, right? And there's also a little ladder here. So if we come up here we can take a look at what's going on outside we can see what's going on with the world see if there's any hostile mobs approaching the house or you know just to have a little view but what do you guys think let me know down in the comment section below if you guys are a fan of this build or not i think it's really cozy and cool but that's just me maybe i might be being a little uh maybe i'm being a little bit biased but honestly i i don't know i just i think it really works it's like purple and white with a cobblestone and stone sort of look i think it looks really cool obviously there's still some stuff to be added but i really like it let me know what you guys think but there's still some stuff to be added added and I just realized if I come in here this isn't changed yet so let me just quickly put an unbrand plank there and put a little jacaranda door wait no maybe I should have it on the outside like that Okay, that's much better. So if I do hit the button, it actually works. I might put a little underground bunker here as well for extra storage, which I actually will do. I put like a storage room here because obviously there's not enough chests in here to actually store all of my valuables. So I'll organize all the chests later on. But what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to make a little dirt path leading towards my house. So something like this. You know, just basically something like this leading towards the door. So I'm actually going to quickly do this. Maybe something like this will look cool. Yeah, so after I clear all of this over here, I might just put a little barn this side of a little roof going on. Maybe put some hay bales in there, put a little horse in there and stuff. I've still got a lot to do, like I mentioned, but we got the whole shell up. So we now have officially a home, which is really cool with a bit of land around us. So I really like it. But we're going to keep these chests here in the meantime. Okay, with a little waystone there as well. We're going to take these up. So these were just to remember what I was actually going to build out of. I might take some lavender. Or oh, actually, I need to eat real quick. I really need to eat but it's becoming nighttime again i'm pretty sure so this is what it currently looks like on the map it actually looks really cool <laughs> I, I really like it what is that thing oh my gosh don't wanna i want to be careful about that but i still have my little cow stored in the ground which i need to get some wheat which i do have in one of the chests and i need to bring them over and make a little animal farm for those guys okay but now i'm pretty sure i'll be able to sleep so that's exactly what i'm going to do real quick i don't want to risk this actually while i do this it's got like a little dirt path going on here which i can then sort of do this and get rid of that actually get rid of this gravel here and then replace it with dirt which i don't actually have any at the moment we'll do that in the morning okay i think that's the uh safer option right i have a pebble what can i do with this awesome i can make rocky dirt and i can make cobblestone from it that's pretty cool well without further ado let's go to sleep okay that is much better so the task for today i need to hunt for some food finish off the little dirt path maybe make some stairs along here as well for like a little opening or something like that i don't know i'll figure that out like a little staircase here leading down towards it maybe like a bridge i don't know and we're maybe complete 
some quests, you know? I mean, what quests have we still got knocking about? Let me go on Overworld here. Okay, defeat the Harbringer. So that's going to be quite difficult. Defeat the Leviathan. Defeat the Conjurer. The Illusioner. Okay, we can craft an aquarium. Oh, craft a backpack. That is what we actually do need to do. So if we can find some rabbits and get some rabbit hide, that'd be pretty cool. We can make one of these backpacks. But we can craft an aquarium. We can do that. All it consists of is glass. So let's go ahead and collect some sand while we can. Oh, then there's some sugar cane over there. We can make a sugar cane farm along here as well, which is pretty nice. But look at this view. It's so beautiful along here. It's like loads of fairy tale creatures would live here. It's just, it's something out of a movie. It's so nice. I can also craft a little fishing rod and fish, can't I? That is what I could do as well. Take that sugar cane though. Well, there's lots of pigs along this side as well, which is pretty cool. So we can take all of their pork chops. I see you, piggy. Don't run away from me. There we go. Ooh, three pork chops off that one hit. Nice. Hello, little bro. There we go. Well, we have found some sand. So let's quickly secure some while we can. Ooh, there's lobsters. Ooh, lobster tail. Nice. Ah, oh, there's a little drown down there as well. Got to be careful about that guy. But we basically have a stack. We might as well get a stack now, actually. So now we have a stack of sand. We also have some pork chops. So let's head back home, cook these pork chops up so we got some food. And then we can go ahead and craft that aquarium. I think it'll look really cool in my house, actually. I might put it next to my bed. Because why not? Maybe I could build a little bridge along here as well. Like here leading to there. That'd be pretty cool. But look at my home. Look how beautiful it looks. It really sets the place off. I really like... I went for that theme. It really just... I don't know. It suits it, you know? It looks good. It doesn't look out of place. It looks really cool. Well, let's go back in here then. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put some coal in here for now. Then I'm going to cook some of these raw pork chops. And then now I can craft an aquarium, right? Oh my gosh, I'm so silly. I have to actually smelt the sand first into glass and then I can craft the aquarium. So let me just wait till this finishes cooking, which won't take long now. And go back to this other furnace though for the meantime and just put that sand in there. So, you know, we're multitasking. We do currently have some wheat, so we can leave these cows over now if we wanted to do that but let me figure out where to put what so i may put a little farm over the back there maybe the animal farm at the back and the food farm in this corner maybe i think that'd be pretty good i also want to decorate it with some lavender so put some of these around like so maybe bone meal it as well here and there we'll add some tall lavender as well do that okay well that looks much better now so hang on a moment let me quickly go up here and have a look yeah okay that looks pretty cool so we've got some lavender going on now we have lots more lavender in the chest so don't worry about that. Oh, but I have an idea. Let me take some of this tall lavender real quick. Okay. So now what I can do is in this corner, I'm going to put a little flower pot and I'm going to put this tall lavender inside of it. So we've got a little flower pot there. But hey, that doesn't matter. We can always get that right. How's our glass getting on? Okay, so now we can craft ourselves an aquarium, right? Look how cool this thing looks. Wait, what do we get for crafting that? Ooh, three to five emeralds. How many did we get? Five. Nice. Let's go. Okay, well, this thing, it can actually be put there, to be fair. That's so cool. My pork chops are done as well, which is good. So I can finally eat at last. Yeah, what do you think? Should we keep it there? Or should we put it up here somewhere? Maybe like there. What do you guys think? Hmm, I'm not sure where to put this, actually. Oh, wait, hang on a moment. I know where to put this. I'm going to put that just here. There you go. Yeah, that looks cool. I'm going to leave that there. So that's another quest complete. What's this? Defend a village from a raid. Oh, you get one netherite ingot for that and five XP levels. That's pretty cool. Whoa, look at this twilight forest. Oh my gosh. Whoa, that's so cool. So to create a twilight forest portal, first make a 2x2 two two infinite water source, then place flowers on surrounding grass blocks and throw a diamond into the water. That is so cool. We're going to definitely do this. We also definitely have to explore the Aether, right? And of course, we'll check out the Nether while we're at it as well. So we can defeat the Ignis boss. Okay. So there's lots of quests to go and complete. So so I'll tell you what we'll do real quick, just so it's done. We'll dig a little, little bit down here. Okay. Have we got torches? We need torches, don't we? Okay. Hold up. Let me actually just craft some torches real quick. Oh, wait, that's charcoal. Oops. Put that back in there. I need to take some real coal. Okay, there we go. So craft about eight of those, which then gives us 32, which is a half a stack. We can put a torch here. Oh, no, we can't actually. Can we? No. We can put a torch there, right? That looks cool. We can put a little torch down there for now. Oh, I, I actually didn't mean to do that. What we can do is though, we can build a little room over here. Maybe go out how big should we have it? One, two, three, four, five, maybe like eight by eight. So we're going to do an eight by eight room. So I think that's necessary. And let me know what you guys are up to right now currently. Are you watching this in bed? Are you watching it while playing Minecraft? Are you watching this while studying? I'm really intrigued. 
So please do let me know down in the comments what you guys are up to. Okay, now if we mine it in a straight line, we should have a perfectly, yep, there we go, 8x8 eight eight room. We can always go bigger if we need to, but I'm pretty sure this is big enough. Oh, we have some coal in here as well. How interesting. Maybe we can put a little mine down here as well. Let me place some temporary torches around here as well so it's easier for us to see, especially so I don't get any mob spawn down here as well because that would be terrible. I've had that happen quite a few times before, so. Okay, well, now we have a checkered roof. Looks pretty cool. What we can do is now we can dig these walls out and then we can do this. Okay. Will that look good? Also made it out of cobblestone. Hmm. We can always change it. Let's just see what this looks like for now. I'm not sure what I think of the roof, actually, now looking at it. Looks like a pizza place. Oh, there's my torches. I forgot there was there, to be honest. Try and put two torches here now. And then just this last wall remaining. And then it should be all done down here, apart from the flooring, actually. I need to put some flooring in. Maybe I might do all of that out of cobblestone. Okay, right. Done. All i got to do is just this floor. So let me take these gravel blocks up. And now the stone. Maybe I can do this as I go along. Okay, nice. Actually, now looking at it, I don't mind it. It's like dark and gloomy down here, though. It's pretty cool. Um, I need to put some ladders here as well. So let me quickly just do a little bit of this. Make some sticks. Purple, white, purple, white. There we go. That looks better. Okay, so now we have our little hidden thing here. I could do this, right? Can I do this? Is that better? Should I just do that? I think I should do that, right? Let's just do that for now. Why not? <laughs> that actually looks pretty cool. But I think that's just an absolute waste of time. So I'm just going to keep these two down here like that. So if I do need to go down here I'll just do that yeah okay that's fine all i got to do is put some chests around here and then i can do a little mine maybe in this corner a little two by two mine i'm just going to do this till i actually hit a cave so i know when to stop and i know if it's actually worth digging down <laughs> well it is another beautiful morning on my lovely lovely base we have an angry mosquito flying around you can't fly into there that's my home well i think today we should maybe decorate this place with more lavender i need to take that flint though because i want to make myself a flint and steel so we can go ahead and visit the nether which i think we are going to do today day so that'd be pretty interesting but let me just continue decorating this place with some lavender give it more character that rhymed did it lavender character does that rhyme am i just waffling right now i'm sorry what do you think about that does that look better yeah see it just looks better maybe add some stairs like so does that look cool can we do that does that work i mean i i think it does all right so then we got some stairs going on here leading down to the entrance is that a crow what are you doing are you stuck there <laughs> okay he was about to get slain so good job you moved pal okay does that look better yeah that works put some lavender along here as well so now we have a little staircase we can put some lanterns on here as well just for now we may add some torches though i say let's go down to the mine mine some obsidian and let's head towards the nether portal let's get more food first and then we can go down there and we'll aim to explore the the nether. Hello, piggy. Only one pork chop. Seriously? Aha. You will not escape me. Boom. Oh, I missed. That was, that was kind of embarrassing. I'm going to give you guys some wheat real quick. I'm just going to use this as a temporary cow farm. Oh, it's a little baby cow. Grow for me. I just wasted so much wheat doing that, didn't I? There we go. Let's cook these pork chops up real quick. And then let me head up to my little bedroom up here. I'm just going to store some stuff that I don't really need to take with me right now. So let's go down to the caves. Let's find some obsidian. And we're going to mine the obsidian. And obviously we need iron as well to make flint and steel. And we're going to go and explore the nether, which is a really dangerous place. And if you guys know me, you know I say this on every single video. I hate the nether. Okay, why do I hate the nether? Well, it's scary. It's the scariest place on earth. Oh, I don't know what's more scary, that or my pickaxe breaking. I forgot to craft myself a diamond pickaxe. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Okay, diamond pickaxe. Do we need anything else? Oh, and down here as well, I forgot to show you guys, it actually leads down to a spider spawner, which is pretty interesting. I'm going to place a torch so none of them spawn. What is in these chests? Oh, luck of the sea. Oh my gosh. What's in here? Oh, emeralds. There we go. Now we can mine some obsidian. Why does obsidian take literally forever to break? So we need four more pieces of obsidian and then we can make ourselves a nether portal. Let's go. Right, let's get out of here. All right, well, let's head back up to the top then and let's make a nether portal. Wait, what is that thing on the map? What is that? Is that a centipede? Ouch. That really hurt. That wasn't even worth it, was it? Okay, well, let's quickly go ahead and put this in here, put that in there, and take one flint and steel out. So now we have our first flint and steel. Where should we put this nether portal? I want to put it somewhere cool. Should we put it, like, here, do you think? So it's going to be, like, in the wall. One, two, three. Boom, boom. Boom. There we go. So now we have the nether portal. Let's go. Let me quickly grab some dirt. Cover it up a little bit. And if we're heading into the nether, I do want to find lots of ancient debris so then we can craft ourselves some netherite. Before we head into the nether, though, we're going to need some extra strong protection. So let me go in my valuables chest, get some diamonds here. I'm going to craft myself a diamond shield. Boom. 
We have a diamond shield now. Okay, so let's take this ordinary shield off and put this normal one on. And now we should look pretty cool. What do you guys think? Let's head into the nether. Obviously, let's eat first, though, because that would probably be wise. Let's go. I'm so scared. We're in the nether and there is a gust. No, 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 no. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. What is this? Get off me. Oh, no. What is going on? What is this? Stay back. Ugh. What are those things? Crimson mosquitoes. Ugh. No, I definitely do not like the nether. Let me quickly dig down to 15 levels so then we can start mining for ancient debris. Ugh. I don't like this. Oops. That isn't good. Okay, now we're at 15 levels, so we can start strip mining now, right? Ooh, some bloodstone. Oh, finally some ancient debris. Oh my gosh, it's about time. I've been looking for you, buddy. Where have you been? There we go. That's what we like to see. I need to find a vein so bad. Like, look how much mining I've done. You can't really see, but I've just absolutely stripped mined, like, for ages. But that's good. We have two pieces now. Finally more. We're starting to find a lot more now, though, because beforehand I literally wasn't having no luck at all. So at least now I'm actually starting to collect some. Ooh, I got lucky with this one. More ancient debris. Nice. Okay, so I've headed up to the top now, but as you can see, let me just take this off now and put my diamond shield on as we're heading to the surface. But I've collected myself 31 pieces of ancient debris, so yeah, let's do this because there's lots of those mosquitoes around. Let's go back home then and get some netherite scraps. Okay, here it is. Yeah, I know, I know. How nice is it to come back to a beautiful home like mine? Oh, my ingots. Okay, well, let's put this in here and have some netherite scraps. Oh, my gosh, there's another one? What? Ah, uh, get off me. Oh, my gosh. Okay, nice. We've got some netherite scraps now, and we need some gold. So, let's go down into the mine again and go and collect some gold. I also just remembered I have a little quest that I completed as well, which is enter the nether. So, that gives us a lingering potion of fire resistance. Any more gold knocking around? And what is this we've stumbled upon again? Oh my gosh, there we go. Ooh, another piece of gold. Okay, so we made it back up to the surface. Let's check on our scraps. Okay, nice. So now let's smelt some of this gold down into some gold bars. And then we can start making netherite ingots. I also found more diamonds while I was down there as well, which is pretty nice. I'm also going to craft a smithing table. So obviously we can upgrade our gear. Smithing table, you can go there. Let me go and grab a bucket of water. And then we can make ourselves a little wheat farm. I'm going to probably put it around about here. Let's get these down. Okay, there we go. So I'm going to let this grow and do its thing and then we can come back to that we have a little temporary wheat farm on our hands don't know where you think you're going buddy let me quickly check on my wheat farm oh there we go that's pretty good so i'm gonna come back and wait till all of these actually do grow i'm gonna head over here and grab a bucket of water just in case i like having a bucket of water on me even though there's not much use in the nether as it would literally just not work at all but hey whatever right it doesn't matter so we have five cooked pork chops some cobblestone to get us around and that should honestly be it so let's go to the nether and try and find a bastion let's go we're back folks we are back oh my gosh not these mosquitoes i'm gonna get some glowstone as well actually because if we want to explore the aether then of course we've got to get some of this right what is that i think we head in this direction honestly i i think we check out what this thing is over here uh oh so i've got to head east then towards that little structure on the map i need to find a bastion though so i can get the smithing templates hmm is there one around here anywhere at all? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, guys. Oh, there's a chest. Oh, with just blackstone in it, seriously? Nothing too interesting there, I guess. Whoa, look at these guys over here. Oh my gosh. Oh, what is this? We got company. Ow. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. How can anybody enjoy the nether? I think it's the most scariest thing ever. Like, look at this. Oh! Oh my gosh. As I was saying, oh no, 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 no. What is this little thing in here? Bad idea. Bad idea. Bad idea. What is this? And we have found it. Whatever we was looking for. Oh my gosh, the nether wastes. Wow. Oh, oh my gosh, what is that? A drop bear. No, these things are so dangerous. I forgot about drop bears. They hang from the ceiling. That's cool. I have a bomb. What? I'm going to take that. See what that does. Smithing template. Ooh, a diamond. 
I don't want to hit that pigman. I didn't want to hit that pigman. I do need to find that bastion. Wait, oh, wait. Well, well, well. I have stumbled across a bastion. This is exactly what I needed. Okay, let's be careful, though. Ooh, I want to put this on. You can't really see it, but it's there. Smithing template. Where are you? Ooh, what is this? Ooh, ancient debris. Nice. Cooked pork chop. Yes. Come to me. Okay, let's keep going down then. Ooh, here we go. This is more like it. We've got to be very careful, though, with these guys. That's who you got to be careful of, right? Right, let's... Uh oh Oh, no, they've they found me. Wow, you deal a lot of damage, don't you, buddy? What is down here? Anything interesting? Maybe a chest with a smithing template inside, or what are we dealing with here? Oh, well, this is a lot easier, isn't it? Therefore, we don't get attacked. Well, we are getting attacked. We're just not taking any damage, right? Aha. Oh, yes. Smithing template. Finally. That is all we needed. Okay. Well, let's take this. Some bone blocks, chains, arrows. Yeah, I could take those, I guess. I want to get out of here now. I've got my smithing template. I just, I want to get out of here, okay? Oh. What do you guys think? Should I head out now? I've already got my smithing template. I've got what I've came for. We can always come back, but that is the most important thing, and we've got it. Let's head back towards the nether portal. Well, this is going to be a long journey back. Oh, not you again. Whoa, what is this? What is this? Oh, ooh, wheat. Nice. I'm coming home. Please get me home now. I hate the nether. Okay, so I had myself a new diamond sword and a new diamond pickaxe. It's now time to craft more of these smithing templates, so therefore we can, you know, have more, essentially. So I'm pretty sure it's never act there. That there and then diamonds all around okay there we go so if i have like take these and then put one back take them again keep on repeating that there we go so i can only have five for now which is enough i have got a diamond chest plate as well a new one that i found on my chest so i'm going to turn that into netherite real quick so what we're going to do is put one smithing template in here and then put our netherite and then put our chest plates that gives us a netherite chest plate we can do this with our pickaxe as well so that's fine and with our sword as well because i mean why not right why not Okay, so let's see what we can do here. So let's take this one off, put this one on. Oh yeah, look at us now. Look how powerful we look. We got a netherite sword and a netherite chest plate. So that is pretty, pretty cool. We need to go and find more diamonds though. That's what we got to go and do. So, oh, wait a second. Did I forget to take my iron out of the furnace? Yeah, I did. Okay, well, I have 30 pieces there, which is pretty nice. Let me just cook this sirloin. I keep calling it sirloin. It's just a hoglin loin. My bad. It's basically the same thing, right? I'm sorry. Uh, okay, so what I got to do first is I got to actually enchant my nether right sword and then i can put this little tomb thing on it let's check if we have any remaining obsidian available okay i don't think we do so what we're going to do is we're going to go to sleep go get some obsidian make an enchantment table make an enchantment room and then we can start enchanting our gear how many pieces of obsidian is it for a enchantment table is it five or six i think it's five right well i have my obsidian so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to head back up to the top and then i'm going to go ahead and craft myself an enchantment table there we go right an enchantment table has been crafted all we got to do now is make bookshelves well 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 i thought it'd be a good idea to bone meal all of my grass as well so it just looks a lot cooler and a lot more filled out if that makes sense so that is what i proceeded to do i placed my soul lanterns above this nether portal here as well it looks all right i suppose i think in the night time it look a lot better not gonna lie i also placed one over there as well on that tree uh so yeah over there and also on there as well but i'm gonna go and check on my sugar cane i placed over here and hopefully some has grown because i need paper okay it actually hasn't yet i'll go for one of these trees over here so i'm gonna take this jacaranda leaf well quite a lot of jacaranda leaves actually i see my home it looks so beautiful you can definitely see that tower from a mile away oh my gosh maybe place one in like that corner there maybe place some there there i could also place this like right here quite mysterious i think the next thing to do on the bucket list is add an animal farm or maybe like a potato and carrot farm but i need to find those first can you guys see that oh my gosh there is literal skeleton horses out there oh my gosh we must have had a, some sort of a thunderstorm or something but we're gonna go down get rid of these mobs and then we're gonna continue trying to build our farm and stuff so let's quickly come out of here okay well there's a creeper please leave me alone oh my gosh okay okay no 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 this is bad because if they shoot that creeper then i oh no oh no 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 no! what have i done oh my gosh what okay there we go nice where's the other guys at i know they're around here somewhere aha you're my shield now. I'm I'm going to sleep. Now we've got some yummy steak that we can munch on. Look at me. I'm full of arrows. Where shall I build this farm? I'm going to put an animal farm in that back corner. So I'm going to keep doing this. Okay. With the seeds in my hand so I can place these down, of course. Okay. Obviously, we need to go and grab some more water. I'm aware of that. Don't you worry about that. How have you gotten the real world? How have you 
manage that. So then I'm going to keep coming out here. Oh, I realized we can go to the Aether as well soon. Oh, that's going to be exciting. That will definitely be exciting. Okay, now that should be looking pretty, pretty cool. So I'm going to get all the rest of the wheat that I uh, have over here. Bring it over there so now we have a little wheat farm. Okay, so yeah, I'm going to take all this up. That's right. You guessed it. So we have 31 seeds in our inventory. So let's go back down here. Oh, I accidentally hit the lantern there. I wonder what that noise was. And basically, I'm just going to go along like this, making sure all my seeds are placed perfectly now we have a little wheat farm going on so wheat farm check now we need really a food farm we can start building the pens right so come down like this right first thing first i do need more dirt so that's what i'm going to take real quick i need to break that cobblestone or stone whatever it is and replace it with dirt of course I hope that grows into some grass for the farm. That should be enough. We can always get more if we need it. Right, so let's head back now. Let me fill this in. It is another beautiful day out here though, isn't it? Lovely weather. Definitely not like English weather, that's for sure. English weather is a nightmare at the moment. I'm going to make a composter as well. Maybe put that next to it so we can get some bone meal. All right, cool. So now we have a stack of dirt. Let's head back over. Don't worry about this as well because we're going to decorate this with some like stone, cobblestone walls, lanterns, hay bales, all that good stuff as well. So it's not quite done yet. Okay, remember this is a work in progress, guys. It's not done till it is done. I'm going to cover this anyways. Okay, cool. Um, am I too lazy to go and get more dirt? No, I can't be. That's just that's just being way too lazy, right? I can't go and do that. If there's any creepers out there listening to me, please do not come for me. I'm begging of you. So I see you guys on the mini map, and I know you guys aren't afraid. So, oh my gosh, this takes up so much dirt. I'm going to dig it all out so it's done. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, at least that's all done now, though. All we got to do is get some dirt. Surely that's got to be enough dirt now. Surely. Okay, it's a beautiful morning and nice. I have a burning zombie on my little wheat farm there that's that's not good one two three yeah maybe make them like this size is that fine like that maybe i think it's pretty nice in this back corner as well actually take all of this like that as well nice so now we got a little animal farm going on yeah that's that's pretty valid so and then we can make a little roof put a little cool roof on it one two three one two three. Oh my gosh can you just go on top please thank you what is with that it went everywhere but where i wanted it to go please say i have enough oh my gosh okay there we go okay now what i can do is i can add a little fish Finishing touch, okay. Turn these into slabs. Hopefully this is enough. It probably isn't. Because you know what I'm like. Always misjudging the number. I always get the figures wrong. And then basically just follow the top with this. I hope I do have enough. I actually might. I might have enough for once. Once in my life, I think I've actually got enough this time. Now the roof's on. They've got a little shelter now. Okay, so what do you think? I think it's pretty cool. I like it. I'm going to cover this up though, actually. I'm going to cover the back up. Eh, actually, have I got to? No, I haven't got to. It might add a little bit of character, actually. <laughs> All we're going to do now is make some fence gates, which I will do real quick. Yeah. Yay, it's done. All we're going to do is add some lanterns and some cool stuff. We'll put some torches on here for now. Can I even do that? Pig farm, sheep farm, cow farm. Oh, that looks pretty cool, actually. Yeah, I might do that. I think that looks pretty cool. Is that cool? All we've got to do now is bring the animals to their new home. So I'm going to go to sleep and I'm going to do this in the morning, bright and breezy. And there we have it. It is now a beautiful morning and we can start moving some animals into our pens. So, right, the first challenge is to bring all of the cows to their new pen. So, ow, zombie. That isn't nice. Okay, well, let's go and grab our wheat and let's bring all of the cows into their new pen. Then I see some sheep over there as well, which I'll also bring. Okay, come on, guys. It's, uh, it's new home day. Oh my gosh. Come on, cows. We're going to go to your new home. Come on now, down here. I know, I know it's a little bit scary, but... Oh no, where are you, what are you guys doing? Look at the wheat. Hello, guys, the wheat. Do not take your eyes off of the wheat. I repeat, don't take your eyes off of the wheat. Almost there now, guys. Don't turn around now, please. That'd be super bad. Okay, so you cows can go in here. All right, that's it. Be good little cows for me. Come on now, you can all come in. Don't worry, I'll give you some wheat for, you know, for coming in and being friendly. We have the cows in all in one pen now. Okay, so that's good. We got the cows going. I'm going to go down here and bring some sheep back here though as well. So I see two on the mini map, so they're going to be brung back. And I might actually bring some chickens as well instead of pigs. Hello, sheep. You're here. Okay, come on. Let's go. Uh, do not fall in there, please. Come on, guys. Please follow me. Yes, yes, yes. This is great. Don't be shy. Come on now, don't be intimidated by the netherite sword. I know it's a little bit scary, but you'll be safe with me, I promise. Come on then, guys. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And you guys can have a little baby sheep. And I'll give you some wheat. Why not? Oh, chicken, where are you? Ah, hello, baby chicken. Come on, follow me. I oh, Actually, wait, we need, we need another one of your friends, don't we? Okay, there is another chicken over here. Hello there, buddy. Come on now, guys. Let's go to your new home. Oh, three chickens. Ha <laughs> ha, that's what I like to see. 
There we go. That's better. Come here, you guys. We've got some chicken going on in here now. We've got some sheep and we have some cows. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. Okay. Nice. Perfecto. So that's that done. So now we've got a wheat farm down. we got a little pen down for the animals. All we need now really is a food farm with some potatoes and carrots, but I'm not quite sure where we're going to get that from. Actually, do you know what? I think we might be able to go to the Aether right now. I think we should go to the Aether. What do you guys think? Oh my gosh, that's so scary though, but I will go. Where is my glowstone? Oh my gosh, I didn't see this. Okay, I have a stack here. Okay, let me just craft as many as these as I can. Okay, 16. Where should I put this Aether? This is actually really scary. I don't know where to put the Aether. I might put it here actually. Like that maybe? It's pretty cool. Oh my gosh, this is actually really scary. I'm not gonna lie. This is actually super scary. And then come along the top. I think that's how you build the Aether, isn't it? The same as this. Oh my gosh, this is actually super, super scary. What? We're about to build the Aether. This is crazy. I've never done this before. And I'm going to go and craft a bucket. And then once I have a bucket, I'm going to go get a bucket of water. And then we can trigger the Aether. This is crazy. I've never done this before. I'm actually really excited. Let's make a quick bucket. I'm going to take this. I'm actually genuinely really excited. Okay, well, I'm going to go to sleep and I will see you guys in the morning. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. Well, folks, it is now morning and you know exactly what that means. It's Aether time. So let's go over here. There it is all in its glory. And I believe all this takes now is a quick water bucket on here. So without further ado, here is your Aether. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Aether portal, no way. I'm going to go to the Aether and see what's about, you know, see what's going on with the world and the Aether dimension. Because I've never ever even explored there. I don't even know what to expect, but here goes nothing, I guess, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh, whoa. What is this place? What is this? What is that? That doesn't look friendly at all. Oh my gosh, wait, where's my shield? What? What was that? What are these things? Oh my gosh, no. What is this, a little tornado? I don't want to walk into that. Oh my gosh, what is this place? What are you? A sheep puff. What do you drop? Okay, this is... I, I don't know what to do. This is super scary, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to set a waypoint here, though, called the Aether. What is that? Is there anything interesting on here? Okay, what is that up there? Oh my gosh, look at these slimes. What? Blue sweat? Oh, look, they're going to attack me. Whoa, Skyroot Log. Look at all of these blocks. Oh, this is absolutely insane. I, I love it here. I love the Aether. I think it's very peaceful. Whoa, that's crazy. What the heck? What are you guys? A flying cow? What? You've heard of pigs fly, but cows fly as well? What? Oh my gosh, I can't hit you, please. This is actually insane. Whoa, look at all these different ores. What? Oh, what? What even just happened? Okay, how do I... Whoa, what can I do with this? Whoa, that's awesome. I can make all of this armor. What? Whoa, this all looks awesome. I want to find more of this Xanite. This is crazy. What? Okay, there's more over here. No way. This is so cool. Oh, yeah, I'm definitely crafting a Xanite sword. Whoa, Xanite shield. I might actually have to craft that. I'm not going to lie. That is so cool. Okay, all I need is like three more of those ores. And there's another one right here. Please hurry up before this little slime gets me. I don't like it. Whoa, look at this. What is this? Ambrosium or... Okay, what is this? Locked sentry stone, what? I can't even break this. Ooh, what is this? Luxweed. Oh, is that... Yes, we found another one. Okay, I need one more piece, come on. Okay, what is this? Whoa, look at these clouds. That is so cool. I can't believe there is literal flying cows here. What is that? Whoa, that is awesome. What is... What is that? Oh my gosh, these clouds actually do need to mind their own business though. Okay, how do I... How do I go over here? Do I, go, do I just build up? right? Visit the silver dungeon. So can I walk along here? Oh, I can. That is so cool. Okay, what is this? Can I get up? Thank you. Okay, what is this in here? Oh, a chest. Whoa, look at this. A Xanite sword, poison dart, enchanted berry, blue gummy sweet. Yeah, okay, this actually looks pretty cool. Oh my gosh. What the heck is that? Oh my gosh. What? That scared me. A mimic. Oh my gosh. That absolutely just terrified me. What is that? You're just going to attack me. Please don't. Are you guys friendly? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh no. No, 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 no. I feel like this Valkyrie's go really going to attack me. I don't know why. I don't like this. Why is there two of you guys? And you deal so much damage as well. Oh my gosh. Okay. 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 Oh, there we go. So we've got a Xanite pickaxe now. We can, we can keep that for a spare. Okay. That's pretty cool, right? That's actually really cool. Can I attack one of these Valkyries? Is this a bad idea? Probably. Maybe. That is so cool, though. But what I realized is we can actually craft a Xanite shield now, so we got what we needed. And also, if we check our quests, 
I'm pretty sure. Oh, there we go. Nice. Some XP levels. Oh, and another five XP levels. So, defeat a Valkyrie. Oh, okay. Defeat the Valkyrie Queen. What? Okay, there's a Valkyrie Queen. So this is one of the bosses that we can actually defeat. So, why don't we just go ahead and do that? Let's take on one of these Valkyries and see how powerful they really are. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You can fly. You can actually fly. Please. Oh yeah, you have nothing on me. Oh my gosh, actually, maybe you do. You're super fast. Wait, what? Why have you stopped? Oh. Oh my gosh. Way, we defeated it. Valkyrie medal. No way. Can I, can I actually put that on? What can I do with this? I don't really want this. I just want to defeat the Valkyrie boss. The queen boss. That's who I want. Wait, but actually, this might be a little bit wise. Okay, there we go. Let's cook some of that raw beef because we need to eat again. I know we need to eat once again. I know, I know. Oh my gosh. How do I get to this boss? Ah, here we go. I didn't see this. Haha, -ha, there's more than just one floor. There's lots to explore. Hey, that rhymed. A holy stone sword. Ooh. Hey, what does that mean? I don't think you should bother me. You could get really hurt. That's so mean. I wasn't even intending to hurt you guys. Come on now. Oh my gosh. We've been mimicked. Where is this? <gasps> Found the Valkyrie Queen boss. So I'm going to block this up so none of the other people can get in. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, oh, the Valkyrie Queen. What can you tell me about this place? I wish to fight you. This is a sanctuary for us Valkyries who seek rest. I wish to fight you. Very well, then. Bring me 10 medals from my subordinates to prove your worth. Then we'll see. I'll return when I have them. Zero out of 10. Did we already have? Oh, that's what it is. So I got to get rid of the normal Valkyries and then I can fight the Queen. Okay, I got you. I got you. Oh, well, let me go over here then. Aha. There's another one. Okay, let me regenerate some hearts real quick. And I'll take you on as well. Oh my gosh, why are you so fast? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, okay, there we go. There's a third one. Oh my gosh, these Valkyries are actually really strong. This queen must be actually really hard to attack. Before I might fight the queen, though, I might craft myself a bow and arrow. Yeah, maybe, maybe I might do that. Oh my gosh, you seeing how fast these Valkyries are? <gasps> I thought I lost you. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, 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 my gosh. <laughs> I'm so scared. Oh, my gosh. I'm actually a pro. I'm actually a pro. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> that was super close. Okay. I, oh, oh my gosh. I, I don't know. I don't know. If I just trap you like this... I mean, realistically, what, 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 like, what can you do? Oh, you can, you can teleport. Of course you can. Okay. Come on, I need one more Valkyrie. Show yourself instantly, please. Whatever you must be, please just show yourself. Oh my gosh, these Valkyries, where are they? Ah, oh, this Valkyrie boss is getting ready. I need one more though. I will defeat you. I promise I'll definitely be taking that sword off of you. You guys are actually super strong though, I'm not going to lie. There we go. Right. Now we have 10, right? So now, can we go and defeat the boss now? Am I ready for this boss? Maybe not actually. Yeah, I, I don't think I'm like at all ready for this boss. How do I how do I get out of here? This place is a maze. Okay, Valkyrie boss is in there waiting for me, but, but there's no way I'm ready for this boss yet, right? Purple squash slice. What what does this do? Can I eat it? There we go. Okay, yeah. So we're going to go back. We're going to enchant our gear and then come back when we are fully prepared because there's no way I'm fighting that unprepared because I have no idea what she is capable of and she could be a very hard boss to defeat. So this is why I'm saying we got to go back and upgrade our gear. What? Oh my gosh. What? Oh my gosh. What has just happened? Um, uh, okay. Oh my gosh. They are not so friendly after all. Um, what is going on? Oh my gosh, I can fly. What? What is this? What is going on? I can fly. Oh, why well, just got humbled very quickly there. <laughs> I'm going back now. I, I got to go home for sure. Oh my gosh. This place is crazy though. When I go back, I'm going to go ahead and craft that um Xanite shield as well while I'm at it. Okay, let's go home. Bye, Mr. Cloud. Okay, we are finally back. We have made it back all in one piece somehow. Well, actually, we did lose a helmet, but what a, what a day it's been. The uh, Aether is very interesting. I'm not going to lie. Ah, there we go. Xanite shield. Let's go. Let's equip this baby. Oh my gosh. This is awesome. Whoa, take a look at this. That is awesome. I know what we have to do for sure, though, is cook some of this food up. Oh, my gosh. And do you know what? I'm actually going to make... I'm going to make these chests as well, actually, while I can. Okay, seven chests. Let's see what we can do with these. I'm going to put two there. I'm going to put 
four there. Well, well, if I can. I'm just going to put all my stuff in them. What do we need? What do we need? Arrows, enchantment table, a little bit of that. We need that because we need to put that in a different chest. Okay, nice. So let's go back up to the top real quick. Let me make more chests again. That should be plenty, right? That should be absolutely plenty. Okay, nice. I'm just going to leave it like this for now. How's my animals getting on? Are they doing just fine? What? Oh, I accidentally hit that again. Boom. That is funny. So, animals, what have you got to offer for me then? Because my wheat still hasn't grown. What is with that? Why is it taking, like, forever? They're not even at 30% yet. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and collect some wheat here. As you can see, I have quite a lot of it. So I'm going to go and just take some of this up real quick. But the aim is I need to go enchant some armor. So I need to go and farm some of these cows real quick. So I'm going to feed you guys lovely wheat because you deserve it for being so good. I'll give you sheep as well. Why not? But yeah, like I was saying, the aim is to go ahead and craft an enchantment table, which we have actually done. And then we also need to craft some bookshelves. Therefore, we can actually enchant all of our gear. Go back to the Aether over there. Destroy the Valkyrie Queen and then pretty much go from there. I mean, we do need to enchant all of our gear. We also need to make a bow. So let's quickly just go ahead and do that. I need string. Okay, I do have three pieces of string, so... Ah, there we go. Okay, right, so we have a bow now, which is good. So all we got to do now is enchant everything. So I want to enchant my netherite sword, my armor... Hang on a minute, I got a little mosquito here interrupting me. But like I was saying, I need to enchant all of my gear, enchant my bow, and then we can go ahead and fight that Valkyrie Queen boss. I just feel like with a good bow, you know, we got a good chance of, you know, picking her off of range, and it's just much better and easier. So I'm going to go ahead and farm some sugarcane, come back and forth, slay some of the cows, and take their leather. Okay, that should do it. Ah, uh, come here, sugarcane. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Oh, there's lots of cows over here, so I wonder if we can take these guys on. I would like to go ahead and explore the better end as well, because, you know, there's lots of cool stuff in there, and also, I would like to craft some better end armor, so we'll look into that soon, but first of all, I do want to destroy that Valkyrie Queen boss like I was mentioning. Come on, cows. And there's one more cow over here. What is this over here? Oh, we've discovered a bridge. What's, uh, anything cool over here or any chests maybe? Or is this just literally a bridge? I love the look of this lavender forest though. Doesn't it just look amazing? Hello pig. Can I take your pork chops by chance? Thank you. We need to get a lot of food as well for preparation to fight the Valkyrie Queen boss. So I'm just going to take these pigs and take all of their pork chops. Want to go and explore the twilight forest as well. We got to go check this out. There's so much for us to do, but we're going to get it all done, right? We're going to, that's the aim. To do everything I want to do, there's no way I'm going to be able to do it in just a hundred days. So if you guys want a 200 days, drop a comment down below and let me know. Whoa, that is so nice. Look at the sunset. First and foremost, let's head inside. Let me cook some of this raw beef. Okay, make as much of this as I possibly can. Make some books. Okay, that's three books now. We need more leather. How is our beef getting on nice? Okay, we need to eat some of that actually. Cows, I need leather. Come on, drop me leather. There we go. Whoa, that is so cool. Oh yeah, I'm definitely doing that. That is actually awesome. Look at these. Whoa, the jacaranda bookshelves. What? That is awesome. Okay, I'm probably going to build a little enchantment room here then. We're just basically going to keep grinding this out. We're going to keep collecting leather. I think we have enough sugar cane. If not, we can keep farming that anyways. But all we're going to do is make more bookshelves and then we can start enchanting. So let's go ahead and do that. Well, take a look what I've just stumbled across. Seems to be like a little villager camp. Hey, villagers, what's uh, going on here? We've got some hay bales going on. Most importantly, what have you got in here for us? Hopefully we can find some cool stuff. Why, hello there, Sol. Any good trades you guys have or mm, not Not the best, but oh, there's a chest here. Oh, okay, nice. Bread and potatoes. Okay, so that means we can actually start a potato farm. I'll take that charcoal. Oh, bookshelves. Yes, this is what I need. Oh, yeah, that's that's perfect. Okay, well, now we can officially have 15 bookshelves now. Anything up here, I've got to be careful. Oh, more bookshelves. Nice. Well, I'll definitely take these as well then, I guess. Anything around here? Oh, a little chest, some more bread, pumpkin pie. Okay, that was a success, I guess. I mean, we have lots of bookshelves now, so I think we should head back, make an enchantment room, enchant our tools, and then go ahead and find the Valkyrie Queen boss. Okay, now we have 15 bookshelves. Let's go. Okay, that's a lot better. So let's go out here, and then we can start implementing a little enchantment room. So I'm saying... Hold up, there is a creeper, so I need to get rid of this guy real quick. I need to put an enchantment room somewhere, but I'm not quite sure where to put one. Put it next to here, maybe make like a little barn thing and then put it in here. So that's exactly what I'm going to do.
Okay, well now I have my little barn in place here. Looks pretty cool. What I'm going to do is I'm going to place my jacaranda bookshelves all around it like this. And then obviously come along like so. And then these four I'm just going to place on the corners like this, that there, then that there. And then now we have our little enchantment room. So we should get level 30 now, right? Yeah, okay, we do. Perfect. So let's grab some lapis and let's get enchanting. How's the food? Oh, oh my gosh. Look at this. A stack of steak, pretty much. That'll be very useful for us. So let's go down here. Ah, uh, my bad. It, it will be in the valuables chest. So I'm going to go up grab the lapis, and then enchant my stuff. Vein mining, I'm breaking three, efficiency three. Okay, that is more like it. So we have an unbreaking three, power three, flame, and punch one bow. Do you know what? That is actually pretty powerful. So, but now we've enchanted some stuff. I'm pretty sure we can go and fight this Valkyrie boss now. What do you guys think? I can go ahead and put this in the anvil as well and put another knockback on my sword. Oh no, I need level 30. No. Okay, that's fine. I'm actually just going to go to the nether, mine some nether quartz and get some XP. Look how fast this pickaxe is now. Oh my gosh, not... Okay. Okay. I forgot about those crimson mosquitoes and how annoying they were. Well, thanks for reminding me, mosquito. There's a whole vein of nether quartz here. Okay, we have our 10 victory medals. Okay, we don't want to waste any arrows right now. We need to use these on the queen. So let's head over here. I see her on the mini map and I'm going to go and settle some business. Oh my gosh, these clouds just don't leave me alone. Really don't want to get hit right now, please. We made it. All we got to do is go down the staircase and defeat this thing once and for all. I'm very nervous though, I'm not going to lie. We also have a dart shooter now as well, so that's pretty cool. We can test that out. Okay, how do we go down here? Ah, uh, wait, yeah, I think I found it. Yep, I have found it, all right. Okay, well, we have to play our cards right, otherwise this could end very, very badly. Very well then, bring me 10. Okay, I have your medals right here. Okay, what do I do here then? Oh no. Oh, 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 oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Wait, I can't arrow you? Oh my gosh. You are very, very strong. Okay, well, this is what I have to keep doing then, is just block and hit. What is that? Oh, no, I've got to go over here and quickly eat. Ooh! Whoa. Haha, -ha, I'm getting loads of hits now. Oh, my gosh, that dealt actually quite a lot of damage. Well, this is going to consist on a lot of it running around, so... Please don't mind me. Uh oh, I missed that. My shield is actually going to break. Okay, come on. Please. Oh my gosh. Run, 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 run. Okay, I need to regenerate. Need to regenerate. Come on, hurry. Oh my gosh. Okay, this isn't good. I just got to run around a little bit. Oh my gosh. She's so powerful, bro. Can't let you hit me. I need to get some crit hits on you. Oh no. I can't let you hit me. No. Oh my gosh, got to do some running around. Please do not die, please do not die. That means everything will be wasted. Everything I've ever done and worked hard for on this world will be completely wiped away. It's fine, I think we've got you all figured out. We've got you all figured out, Velk. Oh my gosh. What? You can break blocks as well? No. We're not scared of you. We're not scared of you. Come on, please. All we need is just you in this corner. Please. Yes, we're doing it. I think we've figured it out. Oh, no. Can't get too close, though. Oh, no. She teleported. She figured it out. I'm literally shaking right now. I don't know why I'm so scared. Okay. Okay. Run, 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 run. Right. Regenerate. Oh, okay. Run. Oh, Oh my gosh. I'm so scared, bro. I'm so scared. I don't like this. Oh, oh, oh. Run, run, run. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. Come on. Come on. Uh, what does a healing stone do? I, I really don't know. I actually don't know what this does. Boom. Okay, come on. She's nearly defeated. Come on, let's go. Oh my gosh. Okay, healing stone. <laughs> now, whatever you do, please do it. Okay, just regenerate. Oh my gosh. Come on. Yes. Please. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh. Not now, not now, not now. Yes, we did it. We did it. Oh my gosh, you are truly a mighty warrior. Let's go. We just defeated the Valkyrie Queen. Oh my gosh, my heart. Oh my gosh. Okay, what what is this? And a silver key. Hmm, what can I do with this? 
I'm not quite sure what I can do with this though, but you don't understand how relieved I am to defeat the Valkyrie Queen boss. Oh my gosh. We figured it out though. We just had to get her in a corner and just keep pushing her back into it and deal lots of damage. But what do I get for this quest? Oh, iron gloves. Okay. Well, we, we got that now, I guess. Oh my gosh. Well, that is our first boss defeated and maybe another one to go. Who knows? Well, of course we have the ender dragon. That's technically a boss as well, right? But let's grab all of our things and get out of here. Wait, is there anything underneath here? Hmm, let's check. Oh wait, yeah. Wait, what is this? Ah, silver key. Okay, what are we getting here? Whoa, a lightning sword. What? Oh my gosh. Okay, we got some smithing templates, so we take that. A Valkyrie queen head. <laughs> um, we would definitely take that, I suppose, as a little souvenir. Valkyrie gloves. Okay, yeah, we'll uh, we we'll take that. Whoa, a Valkyrie axe. What? Invisibility cloak. What is all of these things? I want to take this lightning sword as well, actually. Oh my gosh, no way I'm wearing the Valkyrie queen head. What is this? Wait, no way. Wait, can mobs see me? Oh my gosh. What? Okay, I want to put these gloves on. These are pretty cool. Um, I'm going to leave these gloves on. Valkyrie axe. Whoa. Well, I'm definitely going to use this, I guess. Yeah, that is cool. Okay, well, we have a Valkyrie axe. Oh, I didn't even use my bombs. Oh my... That is cool. I'm going to take these gummy sweets as well. We finally did it, though. We did what we said we was going to do. Defeat the Valkyrie Queen. But we couldn't even use our bow. That literally scared me that I couldn't do that. So at least it's all done now. Oh my gosh. I've done this countless of times. This invisibility cloak is crazy though. Does it work? Wait, let's check this lightning sword out as well. Whoa, look at that. That is super awesome. And just like that, we have returned home. Okay, well now we've, you know, we're back to base now. And actually looking back on it, it actually looks really cool, doesn't it? You know, still a little bit to decorate, but I have an idea. So I was looking at my quests and the Twilight Forest really did catch my eye. And all I have to do to create this portal is make a two by two infinite water source, then place flowers or unsurrounding grass blocks and throw a diamond into it. So I think that's what we're gonna go ahead and do. So all I gotta do is grab with this little bucket of water here. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to create the portal approximately around here because it looks cool. So all I do is make a little two by two, right? Just like this. And actually looking at the quest as well, as you can see, there's quite a few bosses to defeat here, but I would just like to go ahead and check it out and see sort of what's around there. Okay, then all I do is place these lavenders around it. Do these count as flowers? Surely, right? But all I got to do now is toss a little diamond into it. So let me just go ahead and grab a diamond and boom, is it going to work? Oh, oh my gosh, what? I've just been struck by lightning. Okay, no, do not burn, please. Oh my gosh. We've made it, that's for sure. That actually scared me, what? Right, let's go in and check it out. Okay. Okay, we've made it, apparently. Um, what? Oh my gosh. Well, I have to remember where this is, so I'm just going to put that as portal and save that down there, <laughs> so I don't forget where it is. But, look at this place. I mean, the snowy forest? What? Wait, what is this over here? It's very dark around here, though. That's what I've noticed. I should have brought a torch or something like that, but oh, hang on, we have a quest complete. What do we get here? A blank magic map. Whoa. What, is, what do I get with this, then? Oh, okay, it's just literally a map. Okay, well, we're not going to be needing that, really. What is this, though? Oh my my gosh. What are all of these orbs telling me to go somewhere? I don't know. Hmm. I'm going to head in the snowy forest direction because I believe the Yeti lurks in that sort of direction. So I would like to actually go and check the Yeti out. Whoa, look at this. A firefly. Oh, I can put on my head. Whoa, that's super cool. I have a firefly on my head so I can actually like see now. That's actually really cool. I like that. Whoa, look at this place. I mean, I wonder why it's called the twilight. What? What is going on? Um, yeah, get me out of there. Whoa! Ah, no! I'm freezing! No! What is that? Hey, what are you? Oh my gosh! Wait, what did- what did he just drop? Notes by an icy cave by a forgotten explorer. Okay, wait. Let me check this out. Okay, can I... How do I even cross there then? I don't want to get frozen again. That was terrible. An explorer's notebook covered in frost. The blizzard surrounding these snowy lands is unceasing. This is no ordinary snowfall. This is a magical phenomenon. I did see something interesting in one of the nearby point roof towers though. Okay, well, can I not even cross over there then? Will I get just caught in some sort of blizzard? Oh my gosh. Okay, so it's basically telling me to go in a sort of pointed tower thing. I'm not quite sure, but hey, I mean, is there actually no way around here? Is this literally it? Oh my gosh, yeah, it is. Oh yeah, I'm I'm getting out of here. There's no way I'm risking that. Ah, it's another one of these guys, again. Is it just the same book they drop? Yeah, I think it is, isn't it? Yeah, okay, it is. Well, well, that's a shame. We can't check that out right now. We've got to go and see pointy roofed towers or something like that it's telling me to do. Well, I really wanted to go ahead and check that out, but obviously I can't. But whoa, look at this tree. Ooh. Hello, little birdies. I, I, I kind of need you. I need your feathers. Oh my gosh, you're too fast, though. Aha! Give me your feathers. Whoa, look at these things. What do I... I can put it on my head. <laughs> that is funny. But that is super annoying, that sound. Whoa, check this out. What is this? What? 
I have no idea why that does damage. What's around? Ah, ah, ow, 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 ow. Okay, well, that isn't friendly block and hedge. Okay, well, should I go around this maze? Should I check it out? Let's check it out. Why not? Okay, we must have to go around here then. So somehow we've found a maze. Oh my gosh, a hedge spider. Oh no. Oh, stay back. Get rid of the spawner. Okay, anything in this chest interesting? Not really. Let's so I can see something. At oh, hang on. There's another one over here. Oh my, oh my gosh. Mind that, mind that, mind that. Oh, oh, not you as well, spider. Hmm. What? Why is that doing 360s? Ooh, a diamond. Hey, we take that. Get rid of that as well. Whoa, look how many chests are around here, though. Oh, another diamond. Nice. What? What is that? A grass spider? Why is it so tiny? That is so funny. It's so small. Okay, according to my magic map, there should be a boss around here. I'm sure these have got to be bosses, right? All of these on the map. Well, I don't know what I'm getting myself into, but I've found a structure and I'm in the Firefly Forest. So we'll have to see what is in here, but I'm really scared. What? The Naga. What is that? Oh, it's that big snake thing, isn't it? Okay, where is it? Oh my gosh. Is it around here anywhere or... I don't know if I'm even prepared for this fight. Oh, there it is. Oh my gosh. Get it. Oh, look at it. It's so creepy. Whoa. Oh, it stunned itself. Oh. Oh no, it's awake. It is awake. So if it hits my shield, then it becomes stunned, right? Look at it go. Wait, what is it just broke? Oh my gosh, my boots just broke. No. Okay. Oh. 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 I do not like this thing at all. Oh, okay. It's stunned again. Get it. Yes, we got it. <laughs> no way we just defeated another boss. Oh my. Whoa, what is this? Oh my gosh, we got Naga scales. No way. Yo, what? This is awesome. We also got a Naga trophy head. Let's go. I don't know what to do with this. So I, might, I might just put it there. Whoa, that is super cool. Okay, well, we defeated another boss and that was quicker than I even expected. That was actually a pretty easy boss. I'm not going to lie, but we have now officially defeated yet another boss. What can we do with these Naga scales? Can we like... Oh, hang on a moment. I think we can craft Naga gear. Hold up. Let's, uh, let's see what we can do real quick. Let me make a quick crafting table. Right, put that down. Whoa. Oh, that is cool. Look at that. Oh, wait. I can only make a Naga tunic and also leggings. Oh, okay. That makes sense. That's pretty cool, though. I mean, I can still craft all of those things. Okay, let's uh, let's actually get out of here, though. I mean, we can always come back and have a look and check out some other bosses, but honestly, I would rather go and fight the Ender Dragon and see the better end. Well, that was an interesting time at the Twilight Dimension. That is for sure, but let's go ahead and just... I mean, I have another trophy head. This one can go right here. I mean, hey, that's a pretty creepy thing to look at when you're trying to go to sleep, I guess. But hey, I mean, it's a trophy, right? It's, uh, I should be proud of that. But yeah, that's pretty cool. So now I have a Naga Head trophy. So, but now we've done most things. I mean, we've been to the Aether. We discovered that. We destroyed the Valkyrie Queen boss. We've also went to the Nether, you know, fought off some Bastions and looked about there. And we've also just been to the Twilight Dimension. Oh, I actually get a reward that I didn't claim. Oh, look at this, 25 XP levels. Well, look, we'll take that. But now I believe it's time to go to the end. So in order to do this, we got to go to the nether, collect some blaze rods from some blazes, make some eye of enders, kill some endermen, and then we can locate the stronghold and go to the end. I'm so excited to see what the better end is like as well. Honestly, that would just be like super cool. Whoa, oh my gosh, that was a huge explosion. But I have 11 blaze rods now, which is pretty good. But I came back down here to collect some diamonds. So I do see a few and I'm going to take them, okay? What? Please get played at your own game, buddy. Okay, I'm going to mine these two now. There we go. So we, that brings us to five diamonds now. See if I can find any more here. Oh my gosh, what is that? Anything in these? I know sometimes you might be able to get some goodies. Oh, I see more diamonds. Come to me. Oh my gosh, there's another centipede. These guys are so so annoying. Wait, does this actually work? Can mobs still see me? Or am I actually... Com oh, there's loads of diamonds. Am I actually completely invisible with this cloak on? Wait, they seriously can't see me? No. This is so OP. No one can see me with this invisibility cloak on. What? This is amazing. This is not very overpowered at all, is it? So even if I hit you, can you not... Oh, okay. Okay, no, maybe you can see me... Wait, what? Wait, so how can you see me or not then? I'm so confused. Is it when I, if I attack like a mob or anything like that? Oh, that's weird. Okay, well, I'm going to grab my diamonds then. Oh, a whole vein. Nice. going to grab these ones up here as well. Hopefully that centipede doesn't see me as well. Okay, cool. Oh my 
Come on now, zombie. Mind your own business, buddy. Oh my gosh, I finally got it. What does this do? Heart of diamond. I mean, wait, what is it? Does it do it? Ah! Wait, what? Okay. Um, need to collect a few of these deep slate blocks. Like, really quick. Okay, this knockback is really saving me right now. Uh-oh. Okay, go, 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 go. No skeletons, please. Don't see me. I'm going to return home and then we'll go from there. Okay, so we've returned home and to be honest, we have what we need. So we gained some diamonds. So I went ahead and crafted myself a diamond helmet and also a diamond boots. And I've also got some blaze rods left over. So what we're going to do is we're going to put them in the crafting table and turn them all into blaze powders. And therefore, all we need now is some ender pearls from some endermen. And then we can start locating the stronghold and obviously defeating the ender dragon. And of course, we're going to go ahead and explore the better end. Hello, little enderman. Do you want to come and take a ride in my little boat? Aha! No, you cannot escape. So please give me an enderpearl. Please get in my boat. Leave me alone. I just want these endermen, please. Whoa, you're dealing lots of damage. Okay, where are you? Oh, I hear you. Aha, you're down here. Can I get you in my little boat? Oh, no, I'm being chased again. Please. I see you over there as well. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Are you kidding me? Another skeleton. Oh, my God. Gosh! I hear another one. I actually- I hear another one. What can I do to catch a break around here from these skeletons? Please drop me an enderpearl. Yes! Okay, we officially now have 12 enderpearls. Let's go! Oh my gosh, look at my arrows though. Look at my leggings! I have no leggings, no. Okay, so we officially got what we was looking for, which is 12 enderpearls. So, we go ahead and hit this, hit that. We can now make 12 eye of enders. So, that is pretty, pretty cool. So now... Okay, wait, let's actually see where the stronghold is. Oh, okay, so it's over this direction then. Please drop. Yes. Okay, so what we know is we need to head over in this direction. Therefore... Wait, what, what is this sort of like? What was that like northeast? Yeah, so we got to head in this direction up here, hoping to find the stronghold. So, in preparation to this, I mean, we've pretty much got what we need. On the way, we can grab some diamonds anyway, so that isn't, you know, a big deal. And we have a wandering trader. Please be arrows, please. Okay, you have no arrows for us, but whatever. So it's over in this direction, right? Northeast. So, let's head over northeast. Hopefully, we can find some cool things around there as well, and, you know, maybe even visit some end cities as well. That would be really nice. Ouch. Okay, so I'm just going to keep heading in this direction then until I feel is necessary. Oh, a little raccoon. I'll leave that guy to it. Come on. I haven't walked this long in absolutely ages. Days even. Literal days. Ow. It just stood in a wither rose. That's my fault though, to be fair. Hello, squid. Don't mind me. Just passing through, buddy. Just passing through. If you guys are enjoying this so far as well, and you know, you want to see more content around here, then be sure to subscribe. You know, it's free. I'm only a new channel, really. Relatively new. So, you know, I'd really appreciate it. That one sub, you know, really goes a long way. So I'd really appreciate it. Oh my, can this hurt me? Probably. I'm I'm going to go. I'm not going to risk that. And I also see a big grizzly bear, so I'm hoping that doesn't want to... Yeah, I know, buddy. Well, it looks like the rain's clearing up, and it's a beautiful day, actually. That is... That has just changed so fast. It was actually terrible weather and now it's just really nice and sunny. Whoa, there's a cobweb there. That doesn't look creepy at all. Definitely not going down there because it doesn't look so welcoming, does it? Oh, I'm getting hungry out here. There's too much sun and I'm doing too much exercise. I'm doing way too much exercise. Okay, let's see where this goes. Okay, so it's still in this direction then. Please drop, please drop, please drop, please drop. Okay, thank you. Okay, so I'm just going to keep going. The most important thing is I'm heading in the right direction. Hmm, I wonder if it's where these umbran trees are over here where I've waypointed. I've, I've put them down as urban woods don't ask why i just have but whoa look at this over here whoa what is this i need to find some feathers around here take some bread why not whoa this is so cool they're guard villages wow that is awesome any arrows around though by chance or feathers actually oh yeah we need feathers that is one thing we do need oh i want to interrupt you guys hello iron golem don't mind me buddy just you know trying to trying to do my thing okay whoa this is this is awesome that's super cool they got a little aquarium here as well that is really cool bucket of water nah we don't really need that whoa they got another little aquarium here as well oh my gosh there's a skeleton ouch okay that is actually really cool oh my gosh leave me alone just to look at the map look how many villages there are here that is honestly crazy there is so many look this dennis guy he's just look he's on guard at the minute i think they're all trying to go to sleep around here as well actually oh i heard someone shooting okay, i need to go in this house uh oh i didn't mean to do that oh please let me up somebody okay come on I'll just mine through here, why not? Okay. Ooh. I don't really need that, though. Pretty tasty loot, though. Okay, I think I'm getting too distracted around here. Okay, villagers, I'll, I'll, I'll leave you alone. I'll leave you to it. I'll leave you guys to it, because I know I'm being interruptive. I won't do it, I promise. I'm going to go and defeat the Ender Dragon. Ooh, a little waystone here. That's pretty cool. Crazy the things you discover on your way to do other things, isn't it? I mean, better Minecraft is just packed with... There's so many things to do on here. Like, you just can't do it all in even 100 days. It's so difficult, because there's just so much things to do. I've survived near enough 100 days so far, and I am... 
am nowhere near. If you guys were curious, I'm playing the 1.20.1 version by Sharky. So huge shout out to Sharky. Because without Sharky, this would not be possible. I really appreciate Sharky. Thank you. Thanks for uh, making this for us to enjoy. Absolute legend. Oh, I see a witch and a witch's hat. What is in here though? Is this where the witch lives? Okay, fine. I'll leave the witch to it then. Oh my gosh. I hate witches. Not as much as those skeletons though. I hate those skeletons. Oh my gosh. They're so annoying. There is a great big whale. Oh, I don't want to risk anything. I don't know. I just please get me to the stronghold. Like, please, right now. I can't deal with looking at another scary mob. And what is that? Okay, it's just a spider. Uh, go, 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 go. What is that? Are those jellyfishes? And they're coming towards me. Whoa, look at that thing. That whale is huge. Oh my gosh, of course there's two creepers up there, bro. Wait, what? Wait, it's gone behind me now. Wait, this means the stronghold must be down here, right? No way it's under this. There's actually no way. Okay, I actually think the stronghold is down here. No way. It's under this water the whole time. Oh, what is this? Why am I mining mushroom block? Wait, what? What is this? Um, what have I just found here then? What is this? What is this place? I'm in a, I'm in a giant mushroom. What? Okay, um, that's interesting. Well, I've hit this little mushroom place, so... Okay, because there is a stronghold here. I spy... Well, it appears to be I've actually found the stronghold. Yes, I found it. Let's go. I actually found the stronghold. Okay, weird location, but well, we found it. So, you know what that means? We're going to go and find the actual end portal itself now. Of course, there's a skeleton because, you know, why wouldn't there be, right? Well, what I realized is I actually did locate the end portal, but of course, I have no arrows for my bow. So, I need to now go back up to the top of the surface and I got to go and get myself some arrows. So, let me just go ahead and do that. Let's go back to the actual portal. Okay, and we've got all we needed, and now we are back to the end portal. So, let me get rid of this, because I don't want any of those silver little guys attacking me, please. But, I mean, we found it. At last, right? We found the end portal, so all we got to do now is place these eye of enders on top. So, here's three. There's another three. Oh my gosh, we got to be careful about this lava here, because imagine falling in the lava now. That would be absolutely terrible. But here we go, last three. Three, two, one. There we go. We got the end portal. Let's go. I'm so excited to go and dive into here and see what lies in the end. Are you guys ready? Because I am. Well, here goes nothing, I suppose. What the heck? Look at this thing. Whoa, look at this place. This looks amazing. Okay, I'm guessing we have to build over here then. So that's exactly what we're going to go ahead and do. Okay, this is so risky. I'm so scared. Okay, we got to be so careful here. I'm not going to lie because this is so scary. I really do not want to fall down there, please. Okay, I'm going to start building up. I think that's the wise thing to do. So I'm just going to keep going. Build up a little bit. Okay, now all I've got to do is just build across and then we have made it to the platform. That's all I worry about. Please, can I do this safely without falling? I'd really appreciate that. Oh, okay, we made it. Okay, there it is. There is the end crystal. Oh my gosh. Okay, what is this up here? Oh my gosh. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm rushing down. Well, there is the ender dragon. There it is, folks. Okay, so what we're going to do is here is we're going to have to try and build up a little bit. So let me quickly grab my cobblestone and build up a little bit. Oh my gosh. Okay, um, I'm going to get on top of this tower so I get a bit of a better view. Okay, right. Let's see if I can get that. That one up there. Okay, let's see if I can get that. Uh-oh, i just got to be really careful. Come on. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, we're going to be so careful here. We're going gonna, we're gonna to try and get up one of these towers here without being interrupted, but of course we do. Okay, come on, Enderman. Oh, my gosh. It's chasing me! Oh, no. That was super close. I need to eat this steak and regenerate real quick, but I am gonna, actually going to build up here real quick. Okay, let's go. Come on, hurry, 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 hurry. Oh my gosh, that was super close. Um, Yeah, we've got to be super careful here. We have got to be like really, really careful. Keep going, keep going. Come on, let's go, let's go. Uh-oh. Okay, that's that one. Can we get this one? We can, we can. Okay, we need this one over here. Can we get that one? Okay, yeah, we did. Okay, which ones are remaining? Okay, we've got to be super careful, though. What ones are remaining? This one up here, right? I'm pretty sure it's that one, isn't it? Yeah, let's let's build up. Okay, come on, keep going, keep going. Oh my gosh, the ender dragon is right there. Oh my gosh. Come on, let's keep going. I think we made it to the top. Okay, nice. Can we pick off any more from up here? See if we can get this one. 
Okay, wait, is that all of them? I, I think that's all of them. Actually, right, we're going to leave that there just in case. Okay, yeah, we're just going to go down. Where is the dragon? There it is. Come on, come here. Come here, dragon. Come here, dragon. I need you, buddy. I've got to be really careful here. I've got to eat my steak. Please disappear. How long is this going to take? Please. Please hurry up. Please. Dragon's breath, please go away. Finally, it's disappearing. Come here, dragon. I've got something for you. Come on. We dealt a lot of damage there. I'm not going to lie, but the dragon did deal some damage to us as well. So here it is. Come on now, little dragon. Come on. Just please eliminate. Uh oh. We did it. Yes. We finally did it. We destroyed the Ender Dragon at last. Oh my gosh. Okay, for some reason, that was actually really hard. So I'm actually glad we just did that. Okay, well, it appears that we actually did defeat the Ender Dragon. Now all that's left is to really go and explore these end cities. So without further ado, let's go and explore this. So all we got to do now is build it up and then throw a little Ender Pearl inside and then we can go check it out. Okay, and then all we got to do is build over a little bit and then we should be able to just sneak inside here with a little Ender Pearl. Here it goes. Whoa, oh my gosh. Okay, where am I? Whoa, this looks insane. What is this? This is crazy. What are those things? This place looks insane. What is that? What is that? Oh my gosh. What was that thing? Whoa, what is that thing here? Oh my gosh, that is actually really scary. Whoa, look at that thing. What even is that? Oh my gosh, it's flowing around though. What, what, what are you, an endergrade? Hmm, what do you have to offer them, buddy? Shall I attack you? Oh, was that a bad idea? Okay, hopefully not, but that looks really, really weird. I'm not gonna lie. I wanna see what you drop, though. Can I stand on this? I feel really bad, though. <laughs> I actually do feel really bad. Where did you go? I know you're around here somewhere, buddy. Show yourself, Endergrade. Oh, oh, oh! Why did that scare me? Oh my gosh, that, that genuinely just scared me. Oh my gosh. Look at this place, though. Check it out. It looks awesome, right? Okay, I wanna see what this is all about. Okay, what do you drop? Capsid. Hmm, what can I do with this? Okay, let's keep heading further into the forest. Over to this, the Lantern Woods. Ooh, looks really cool though, doesn't it? I mean, check it out. Look at this, it looks awesome, right? What are these things? I like vines, they look really cool though. Okay, I have got to be careful though, because there are <gasps> some things lurking about. Okay, anything down here then? Ooh, what is, what is that? Whoa, check that out. Should we go over there? Let's go over there. Oh yeah, okay, let's be careful though. Wait, what is... What is this thing? I think we might have found something here. There's some chests inside. Let's go and check this out. Okay, um, I'm just gonna go up here, if that's okay. Okay. Whoa, check this out. We're on a little ship. Okay, I do want to be careful though. Oh, there's a crafting table. Nice. Anything around or is this, uh... Oh, some chests. Wait, they have nothing inside? Seriously? They have a potion of healing here, so I suppose I could take that. Take two of those, why not? Nothing even on here then, like, at all. Ah. So there's, there's no... Oh! Haha, -ha, an ender chest. Okay, well, that's a shame. There's, like, literally nothing on here then, right? Well, that was fun while it lasted, I suppose. Ooh, look at it, though. I want to head in this direction, though, like I mentioned, because I want to see what that huge structure's all about. I'm running out of food. Okay, I'm going to save that and then eat a piece of bread. Where is my bread? There it is. Let me eat my bread. Oh, my. Look at this place up here. Wow. Ooh, what are these? Aurora crystal shards. Wow. Those are... Awesome, to be honest. Oh, this is what we can use for crystallite armor, right? I think this is something to do with it. That is actually really cool. Gotta be careful, though. I don't want to fall down, but there's a bunch of this stuff. Okay, I've got a whole stack of it, so I mean, hey. That is pretty cool, though, isn't it? Okay, so we managed to grab two stacks of that stuff, so I mean, that, that's enough, right? I'm gonna mine through here, collect some end stone so I can build over to that structure. Yeah, I might just grab a stack of this stuff. That should be enough. I mean, all I need is, honestly, to get over to that other side. Actually, you know, you know what? I might be okay like this. Yeah, honestly, I'll be fine like this. Hang on. If I just yeah what am i even talking about there we go okay oh look at this though this is awesome okay let me mine up here actually i'll just build up that'd be a bit quicker actually okay what is over here then so 
I'm in the crystal mountains as of right now. So what can I do with this stuff? Oh, I can make Aurora crystal. Oh, okay. So I can literally just make that again. Pretty cool. Those pretty cool. I'm going to get on this mountain. So, you know, I got more of a view of the place. Hmm. Looks amazing, right? Okay. I got to go and check that out though. Whatever this is. I mean, look at all these things flying in the sky though. Crazy. Crazy place. Okay. Let's hope I don't get attacked. Um, what? Okay. So I can't touch that. What is this? Ow. Well, I'm so confused. What is this then? Okay, well, I just get it. Yeah, I just get attacked by that thing. What is that? Yeah, okay, okay. Ow, ow. Well, whatever it is, it doesn't like me. That's for sure. Let's check the map out here. Any structures that catch my eye or anything like that? Oh, what is what is that? Ice Starfield. Whoa, let's go and check that out. I have still got to be very careful though because i have no idea what creatures lay in here i'm not gonna lie i i have no idea whoa look at that place check it out okay uh let's head in this direction like we was planning on doing i gotta go and check whatever that thing is maybe it's just i don't know <gasps> what is that whoa okay there is so much to uh unfold right now oh anything in here i wonder this is something right what is this can we get inside of it or aha we can all right let's go and check this out oh no not, not you guys oh my gosh guys come on oh my gosh there's so many of you go off i'm trying to do something here yeah i just want to check this out mm. oh no oh no oh no okay ah where did you come from Okay, I'm getting out of here. I I can't be messed. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna I'm gonna go down here then, like I was gonna do. Okay. Um. Whoa. What What is that thing though? That looks amazing. What is this thing? What? Okay. That that looks crazy. Okay. But most importantly, what is what is all of this? Okay. Let me inside, please. Oh, smithing template. Netherite hammer upgrade. Bottle of enchanting. Ooh, totem of undying. Yes. Okay, we can actually take that then. Okay, what is all of this though? Apply to diamond hammer. Oh, hang on a minute. We have a quest up here that we haven't yet got. Oh, look at this. So we have a choice of 16 spectacle arrows or two beds. That's pretty funny. What do we get for this? Oh, we also get a totem of undying for that as well. Okay, well, we have now a totem of undying. So I feel a little safer. I'm not going to lie. I do I do feel safer. I mean, wait, let's go ahead and check out this structure over here. I'm not looking at you, Enderman. Uh-oh. Uh oh, uh oh. Okay, how many are behind me? Okay, it's just one. Whoa, look at those things. Oh my gosh. Seriously, guys, is this what we're doing? Oh my gosh. I hate Enderman. I'm not gonna lie. I thought I didn't like skeletons, but Enderman, <laughs> I mean, they're up there. Okay, there we go. Okay, what are, what are these things? Cosmic cod. Oh, you actually dropped fish. What? I think I might be able to cook this, though. I'll keep it just in case. I'm not looking at you, Enderman. I'm not looking. Oh no, that poor guy's stuck. Let me help you, buddy. Let me help. Oh, okay, I don't think I helped. Wait, a neon cactus. This does damage? No way. A neon cactus. This is what that was. Oh my gosh. So we're in like the end desert biome, is it? Yeah, the dust wastelands. Oh my gosh. Well, would you take a look at this? Oh my gosh, there's lily pads around. I mean, there's like little jellyfishes in there, it looks like. This looks absolutely beautiful. Look at it. Oh my gosh. Wait, I wonder if I can... Oh, yeah, I can. So I can do some parkour on these lily pads, which is pretty cool. Okay, that is actually really, really cool. I like it. I really do like that. Okay, what is down here though? It's called the Mega Lake. Okay, well, what is this called through here then? I don't want to go near these things because they actually deal damage. Oh, no, not you. Oh, my gosh. Uh, uh, uh. What is that? Corruption. What? What does that even do? Okay, come on, guys. And there's more of you. Okay, cool. I want to check that out, though. What is that? An end slime. No way. Oh, my gosh. Please leave me alone. Ah, little end slimes. It's really funny, actually. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Oh, no. Yeah, I'm near this thing again, aren't I? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Check out this wood type, though. It looks really cool, actually. I feel really bad attacking these guys. I feel like they don't even do anything, so I'm going to stop attacking them. I'm not looking at you, Enderman. I'm not looking at you. I'm minding my own business. Don't worry about it. Whoa, look how cool that looks. That is awesome. Look at all those fish. What? That is awesome. Okay, anything down here? I don't want to fall down a little hole. That would be bad. Okay. okay, let me build over here. Okay, there we go. The foggy mushroom land. Hmm. Are these like huge mushrooms then? They're like big mushrooms. What is that up here? Like a tree house. Whoa. Check this out. What is this? Oh my gosh. This looks cool. Okay, anything in here though? No. Whoa. Check this out. I want to live in here. Guys, I, I, I want to live in here. This is... This is actually the coolest thing I've ever seen. Oh, what is this? Shadowberry. Ooh. And a chest. 
Whoa, look at this. No way. We have lots of these. So what can I do with these? Hold up a second. Okay, let's get rid of that. Let's take those. Let's take that. I'm going to take that axe as well, actually, because that is super, super cool. Okay. Okay, yeah, that's cool. We'll take that. That is really cool. We've got some tools. Oh, we have barrels here that I didn't even see. Endstone smelter. What can we smelt in here? Anything else around? No, but that is pretty cool, though. So we've got some of these, but what can I do with that? Okay, so I can make stuff with it. So I can make a chest plate. I can make all these different things. A fiery ingot. Ooh, fiery blood. Okay. What can we do with fiery ingots? Ah, okay. So we can make armor out of this. Gotcha. Well, that's pretty cool. I wonder if there's any more tree houses like that. I didn't even notice that. So you got to look around. In these places, you really do got to look around. Otherwise, you, you could miss it. Ow. Oh, my gosh. Those things deal damage. Do not underestimate those little jellyfish because they actually do sting a little bit. I'm not going to lie. That, that did sting. Well, well, well. Ladies and gentlemen, I think we have just located an end city. So... Let's go and check this out. This should be pretty interesting. Well, I hear the shulkers from an absolute mile away. So let's see what we can do here. Oh, hello, guys. Oh, no. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Come on now, guys. Don't be so, so rude. Okay, I need to go to the top. I need to regenerate real fast. I'm not going to lie. Come on, I've locked myself in. Okay, another totem of undying. Uh, what is this? Smithing template. Oh, there's an efficiency three pickaxe. So that's pretty cool. I'll take that. I've got to be really careful here, haven't I? Oh, there's a shulker. I think it's just a spawner, isn't it? I'm going to get rid of this, though. Got to be very careful going down these slabs, though, just in case anything does go sour. Shulkers are so annoying. Like, I'm not going to lie. But look at this. How do you even, you know? Uh-oh, I've been here. I've been here. No. Ooh, I say we acquire some of this wood. What do you guys think? Ooh, yeah. Let's take some of this. This looks really cool, actually. It turns into pink once you um put it in the crafting table and convert it. So that's pretty good. We'll keep that just for now. What is that thing? Um, is this a bad idea? No? Okay. Oh my gosh. What did that drop? What, what even was that? Did you guys see that? What, what even was that? That was crazy. Wait, well, look at this. It's all like invisible. Purple jelly shroom cap. Okay, that isn't scary at all. Oh my gosh. Check this place out though. This is actually crazy. I wonder if there's any ores you can mine here. You know, I know there's a few, but is there any around? Okay, there's some here. You know, we can acquire some of this, I guess. Why not? We'll take some of that. Okay. Any more like other ores though, maybe? That'd be pretty nice, but we're trying to discover some. We're going to dive deeper into this little biome here, see what's around. Check all this out though, umbrella tree. Whoa, whoa, look at this. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, look at the little blossoms. Oh yeah, these are cool. Okay, what's up here? Anything around here? I see a few things on the map and I don't know what they are, but I would like to go and check them out. I don't know what I'm about to get myself in for, but it's, uh, it's worth it guys, come on. I feel sorry for that little guy. I don't know why I keep doing that. They're not even hostile mobs, I don't think. I think they're actually friendly mobs. <laughs> so, okay, what's around here? Oh my gosh, this place is surrounded with the all these items. That's for sure. Yeah, this place is massive. These biomes on this shaders look absolutely insane though. Oh my gosh. This Enderman isn't happy at all. Okay, come on Enderman. Oh, thankfully the Enderman didn't get a hit on us because that would have been kind of bad. But look at that thing over there flying around. What is that? I want to get that. I want to go and check that out. What is that? Can we try and hit it? Or is that, is that going to be difficult? Yeah, that's going to be hard for us. Oh, wait, it's right here. Oh no, wait, I can't shoot arrows at it. Oh no, I think it's coming towards me now. Look at it does look really cool, to be fair, doesn't it? That is awesome. Oh, there's another one. Oh my gosh. Okay, I don't want to start on you guys. There's a whole family of you. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna chill with uh, shooting the arrows at you guys. I apologize for that. Okay, what is this here though? Oh, look at this wood. Whoa. I gotta get me some of this. That is awesome. Oh my gosh. That is cool. That is super cool. What is that? Okay, I thought I was being attacked there for a second. I was going to say that is a risky, risky area for me to be standing on to be attacked. I'm going to take this wood, though. Oh, my gosh. Looks crazy. Yeah, this is awesome. Look at this, bro. That is awesome. The sound kind of puts me off a little bit because I'm not going to lie. It sounds really scary, but it's actually all right. But um, no, that is cool, though. Those uh, wood types are really cool. The better end really is better, guys. Come on now. I didn't mean to look you guys in the eyes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Good thing I can handle you guys, eh? Take your little ender pearls so I can teleport, essentially. I wonder if I can enter inside of these things here. That would be pretty interesting, wouldn't it? What is that? Oh my gosh, what what portal is that? What? what? Okay, what actually is this? Is this like, is this just a structure? Or can I actually go inside of this or what twisted coral this stuff's interesting looks really cool though doesn't it what does this structure do here what 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 is, what is that portal like what actually is that i've got to go and see what this is there's some pedestals here internal ones oh i need that 
back. Yeah, what it, what actually is this? I don't know how to set it off. Maybe a flint and steel, but I haven't got that on me. Yeah, I, I have no flint. I have no idea what this is, but whatever it is, it looks insane. These endermen are really eyeing me up, aren't they? Oh, wait, what is that? Oh, most importantly, what is this? Wait, can I get this? Uh, uh. Okay, we got it. What, what even is that? Like a little firefly or something like that? I'm not quite sure, but I want to check this out. So we've already discovered one ship, but I'm really curious what, you know, what's on this one. Let's go and check it out. So let's go and jump at the top here. Do a little bit of parkour. Come on now, Scoops. Let's just make things easier and just build. I think that'd be the safer option. But let's check this out. So I've got to look out for some any hidden chests or anything like that. Let's actually dive into here then and see what they have to offer for us. Okay, nothing in these chests once again. That was quite pointless, wasn't it? There was actually nothing in those chests. Okay, great. Anything else around here that I need to, you know, take a look at? I'd like to see more structures, you know, like the little ship, but maybe like a bigger one or some sort like that. I mean, there's all these floating things in the sky, but I can't see any actual big structures to go and explore. Now, I'm sure there's loads around here, which I'm pretty sure there is because there is some boss to defeat and I have actually looked on my quests here so if we just take a look so we have the ender guardian we have the ender golem the void worm and the shelterer so in order to defeat these I have to find it in the end islands so if I do come across anything like that then obviously we will go and contest it and see what's going on but until now I mean let's just explore the place you know what's on this island for example <laughs> there could be uh, more tree houses actually like that one we explored last time whoa look at the size of that slime that is a pretty big slime. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I accidentally just put it inside of the lake. That is, that's my fault. Well, I'll leave you guys alone, I guess. Okay. I don't want to interrupt you. What is that? What are those? Come here. Oh no, I can't even, that makes sense. A lot of these mobs, you can't even bow an arrow, which is actually kind of unfair because they're so far away. Oh, there's a little waystone here. I'll trigger that just so I know if I ever need to come back here. I mean, it's now waypointed, so that's very useful. These cactuses actually looked really cool though. Are you going to attack me now or are you just like floating around? Okay, well, I'll leave you to it. I'm sorry. I apologize. Neon cactuses look so cool. Tell me these don't just look awesome. I really want to take these home with me. I don't know why, but I just, I really want them. Look at them. They're just, they're so bright. So we found another one of these things. Okay, there we go. It's now waypointed, so I shouldn't lose where that is. What was that noise? Is it this guy? Look at it go. Look at it. It's just so funny to look at, but it's, it's pretty cool. I'll, uh, I'll leave it to it. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. These logs here are so cool. I mean, look at those planks. Those look amazing. Oh, wait, actually, we got a question. I haven't even claimed it yet. Oh, no, yeah, it was that. My bad. I have already seen that, actually. Let's go and check this out over here. Oh, no, don't go in the tree. Okay, I'm fine. There we go. That was, uh, that was pretty safe. Oh, my gosh, guys, take this in. I mean, just take a look around. This looks awesome. I've never seen anything like this before in Minecraft, like ever. This is just absolutely awesome. How cool would it be if we like built a house on here? If you guys want to see a 200 days, let me know because I haven't even unfolded everything in this mod pack. So if you would like to see a 200 days, let me know down in the comment section below and I can make it happen, you know, because there's still a lot of stuff that we haven't yet done. Oh, there's a chest. Oh, I have Ender. Nice. Enchanted book. Oh, look at this. But if you guys would like to see a 200 days, like I mentioned, do let me know down in the comment section below because I'm not going to lie, this mod pack has been a bunch of fun to play and I would love to just go ahead and play it again for you guys. But defeat more bosses next time, obtain better gear, you know, just better our base. I would Honestly, I'd love to start doing that. So if you guys are interested, let me know down in the comments and I can make it happen. But what is this for now? Look at this though. This is cool, isn't it? Amberland. Ooh. I believe you mine around this way and you can find amber gems. So that would be pretty cool if we could find some amber gems. I think that's how you obtain them, right? It's just mining them and like finding the ores maybe oh look at this it's like a big star is it actually anything on this though or is it just a structure because i'm so confused see there's lots of these things around it's just i don't know if these are just structures or what they are oh look at that over there those are cool yeah i doubt there's actually anything on those i think they are mainly just structures to look cool oh a little uh end slime here tried to attack me sneaky little thing yeah so these are just big structures right i mean they gotta be let me just check my map here oh we gotta go and check this out what is that yeah 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 come on let's let's head over this direction then whoa look at this bro we gotta check that out yeah we're, we're, we're going over here we're going on the hunt guys we are going on a mission okay so i'm gonna have to obtain some ender pearls and ender pearl my way around this place okay so we made it the end barons Ooh, that looks pretty cool. What is that? Oh, okay, it's another end slime. I was going to say, is that a new uh, a new mob or what is that? Wait, what is that though? It's like a hot air balloon or like a blimp. What is that? That is awesome. Let's go and uh, let's go and check this place out. Whoa. Oh my gosh. There is a lot of you guys. I'm not going to lie. Oh, what is that in here? This thing attacks me though. Ow. I have no idea what that is, but it always attacks me. Why me? Come on. Okay, look at this though. That's pretty awesome. Let's go and check this thing out. Okay, so I'm... What? Hang on just a second. What? 
What did I do? Whoa, look at that thing. What is that? Oh, even that takes damage in this biome. So it must not like anything. I wonder... What? Okay, I don't know what that just did. Okay, all right, let's head up here then. Let's see what this is all about. Okay, come on, be something good for us. Come on, we need something good here because there's normally nothing in these places. Okay, it's just empty chests again. Okay, I'm... Oh my gosh, this is such a waste of time looking at these places, I'm not going to lie. I always expect to see some good loot. I don't know why. I always get my hopes up, even though every single time there is literally nothing in here. Well, I'm going to go down here. Let's go and explore this place. And what is around here? Oh, small end islands. Ooh. Yeah, we'll check this place out though. Okay, let's go and see what's around here. I don't want to enter in that little thing over here because it just attacks me for absolutely no reason and i'm not gonna lie i am quite offended you know what, what did i do to deserve that you know i, I just I, I don't get it it always wants to attack me for like why me i'm innocent guys come on now stop playing with me what did i do to deserve that i don't know but let's explore this it looks like some structures are around so we're in an umbrella valley okay that's quite cool uh what is around here i mean i can't see anything that sticks out too much i mean these are so cool what are these called loom corns loom corn okay well that's pretty cool yeah we just went over there didn't we yeah okay so we've already been over there and explored that anything else around because i can't seem to see anything i mean i want to see like a big dungeon or something like that where is all of that at? okay so we've just been there what is this the end barons we can go and check this out just exploring the map here see if anything catches my attention might go over here check out the end barons what direction is that in down here right okay so it's like south well let's go south and see what the end barons are there actually might be some cool things along here so i gotta i gotta watch out i gotta look out keep your eyes peeled guys at all times at least i have food supplies because out here I don't think you're getting much food supplies. Oh, poor Enderman. I mean, this is just attacking everything. I don't know what its purpose is, but whatever it is, honestly, I'm, I don't know. I just, it attacks everything it sees. I don't even want to get too close to this thing because I don't want it to attack me. I know not to say get my hopes up in these things, but yeah, you know, I've got to go check it out, right? I mean, how can I not? Go and check it out. There is an ender chest. Is there anything in it? Of course there isn't. But there's nothing in these chests and I don't, I don't know why. I thought there would be, but there's not. Hopefully we see something else around here. I mean, is there anything? What is this? Oh, hang on a second. Let's check this out. Let me chuck a little ender pearl up there. Whoa, what is this? Okay, well, this is cool. Um... What's around here then? Whoa, blossom berries. Leather wrapped stick. Terminite armor. Ooh. Well, I'll take it regardless. Okay, that's cool. Purple bulb lantern. That is actually really nice. Oh, okay. This is what we'd like to see though. You know these? Ingredients forge plates. Okay, uh, we'll take that. We will take that. See what that does. Well, look at this sponge here. Oh, okay. More ender pearls. More of these sweets. Not sweets, jellies even. What am I, uh, what am I talking about here? Oh, look at these pedestals here. Pretty cool. Some buttons on them. Don't really need that though, not gonna lie. Any hidden chests around? Because I don't want to hit, <laughs> that's, that's the thing, I just don't want to miss any chests. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave every door open so I know what I've explored and what I haven't. Now, I'm pretty sure we've already been in here, haven't we? Okay, cool. Let's go over here. Whoa. Okay, so we finally found something then. Let's see if it's worth our time. There could be something cool inside one of these buildings. So we gotta, we could have a good look around because, you know, we don't want to miss anything like I mentioned. Uh, oh, what is, okay, something down there as well, so I won't miss that. I see another chest. Oh, these amber gems. Okay, we got amber gems. Nice. Uh, I'll take these then. Amber gems. Why not? Oh, firework rockets. Nice. Okay, what can I do with those? Should we see? Oh, look at this armor. We can actually craft some really good armor here. Let's see if we can keep finding these. Oh my gosh. Okay, yes. Right, how do I... What should I drop here? I'm going to drop that. Okay, I'm going to collect all of these. Um, I feel like I should collect these as well. Fire rockets. Yes, in case we find an elytra. Ely That'd be pretty good. Okay, that was a pretty juicy chest. See, you gotta look around for things like this, guys. More ender pearls. Ooh. Okay, so we have a stack of these now. Whoa, what, what is that? Yeah, well, I don't think that's anything, is it? I don't know. Ooh, check this out. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at that. It's like a little bed. <laughs> it's actually really cool. I wanna craft some of this armor, though. Look at that. That is cool. So, I have to do a terminite chest plate. Ah, uh, okay. So, I need these, right? These forged plates. Is that right? Because if I hit a crafting table, I can't just go ahead and craft that, right? Let's test that theory. Um. Yeah, okay. So, yeah. So, we gotta, we gotta, I think this is for tools right i think i think it is yeah so the ingots are just for the um the ingots are just for the tools but in order to obtain the armor i have to get these plates right is that how it works so i've got to put it in a smithing table with a template so i've already got that as the template isn't it okay yeah so i put that with the plates but how do i get the plates hmm wait no i think that is it right that is how that is how you get the plates i don't know how you get these plates i really don't know but we'll uh we'll see if we can find any um okay more 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 smithing templates let's head over in this direction though because I know there's more houses over here, so we're going to check it out. Oh, 
It's got like a little farm going on here. That's pretty cool. Okay, what's uh, what's in here then? That's cool though. They got like a little barn here. It's actually really cool. There isn't any animals though, I don't think. Hmm, interesting. Okay, let's head up this way then. Okay, and what is in this? Oh, there's a house over here as well. Whoa, what is that? Oh, okay, no, there is more. <laughs> Never mind. There is a lot more, actually. Nice, more shadow berries. We'll uh, definitely take those. Those are yummy. Another one of these. Normally, there's good loot in here. Okay, more ingots. Okay, there's another one of these. So, And more amber gems. That's uh, the important thing here. Let's go up here. Any Anything in here? It looks broken to me. What, why is it all broken? I'm pretty sure that's all the buildings, right? I've explored. Is that all the buildings? I think so. I want to take these flower pots, actually, for my home. Yeah, let me take these. Give me the pots. Okay, I got the pots. That's all I wanted. Bro just came to the end to get some uh, flower pots. That was funny. Well, yeah, then I'm, I'm pretty sure we have, uh, we've done this little area now. We I can mean, go and see what this is. Go and check this out over here if we really want to. Okay, what is around here for us then? I believe we haven't been to a biome like this before an umbrella jungle have we maybe we have i might be mistaken but this looks pretty cool i mean take a look at this place the trees look insane oh what is that okay let's check that out we love structures that's all we want to see is the structures i'm gonna sneak my way through here oh there's an enchanting table no way little brewing stand whoa look at this okay that's pretty cool I like that this is the trouble right what do you uh what do you even drop here okay that's cool that's cool oh Smithing template. What was that? Sword blades. Aglytra or terminate anvils. There is so much to... Honestly, there is just so much to carry. Like, I'm not even lying. There's just so much to look at. It's interesting. It's good. It's a good thing though, right? That's what we want things to look at. Oh no. I've accidentally looked an enderman in the eye once again. Just as I was getting into this. Ah. Can I outrun it? Nope. I absolutely cannot. Ooh, uh, uh. Okay, there we go. Nice. Okay, these better end dimensions must be so huge because I'm not going to lie. I've explored quite a lot and I haven't even discovered most things yet. I haven't even come across like a dungeon yet or anything like that. So it just goes to show how big this place probably is. I've explored quite a bit of it, to be fair. You know, we've explored a lot. Um, even ran into a few structures. We ran into a little end city as well, don't forget. So we've done, a, we've done quite a few things. But honestly, I just can't believe how amazing this really does look. The video doesn't do justice. You guys must play this pack yourselves if you'd like to play it i will probably leave a link in the description down below so you can go and play it for yourselves and if you do let me know how you get on let me know if you like it or if you dislike it but i'm sure you'll love it there's lots and lots to do for you grinders out there who just love grinding the game all together and just love normal minecraft well this here you're absolutely going to adore it's super fun there's always something to do like super fun super easy well actually it's not it's not i mean it's not easy i wouldn't say it's difficult but you know it does take quite a lot of effort so be prepared to stay on the grind if you want to get good tools on this but i've really enjoyed it so far you know i'm loving it if you guys are loving it then show your support drop a like on the video and let me know what you want next but i do think we are going to return home as we've explored pretty much what we wanted to explore so i say we just go home so i'll see you guys when i'm home i guess and well just like that we have returned home we have made it back to base and there's a few things i want to do but let me just go to sleep really really fast because it's quite scary and nighttime outside oh my gosh that is super creepy looking at me the naga trophy okay and just like that it is it is morning time so i believe we are safe to go outside and not get attacked by the way i added this little end rod what do you guys think do you like it i think it's pretty cool little uh, cool addition to the little chest room so i've grabbed some umbran planks and i'm going to grab some normal coal which i have there stack and what i'm going to do is i'm going to make a few lanterns so hold up a second make some sticks and then make some of this okay eight lanterns cool so we have eight lanterns now and i need cobblestone have i got cobblestone yes i do and actually cobblestone walls what i need so let me go in here craft myself some cobblestone walls real quick okay so it's just some at the bottom here now what we're going to do is on our little wheat farm we got going on here oh actually wait i need hay bales and over here i believe there are hay bales so i'm going to go in here go to the little pillager camp steal all of their hay bales and use them on my little wheat farm for decoration so i'm going to have like little walls hay bales lanterns on top it's gonna to look pretty cool i think yeah uh, i think it'll look nice so i'm gonna go over here all the way over there i need to be um i'm gonna grab their hay bales like i mentioned and decorate my little wheat farm actually it's not a little wheat farm it's you know it's actually a decent size wheat farm okay i like it it's got what i need by the way what is this who lives in this rock anyone oh lantern and iron nice how far are we from the oh okay it's here <laughs> right here we go. Hay bells. Hello. I need you. Wait, did I just hear a village? Wait, no way there's a village. 
<laughs> There's a villager here. No, I didn't even see you. I could have employed you on my lovely base. Well, we can save that for the 200 days. If you guys would like to see a 200 days, please do let me know because I'll do a bunch more for you guys. So do not worry about that. I'll even include this little guy here. So make sure you let me know if you would like a 200 days. But I've grabbed my hay bales and now I'm heading back home. Let me know what you think about the build as well. I think it looks so cool. Okay, but I have what I need. Okay, I'm going to put one there. No, not like that. <laughs> I'm going to put one there and then I'm going to put a little lantern on top. There we go. I'm going to add one right here as well. Oh my gosh, I keep making that same mistake. Well, we got a little farm decorated now. What do you think? But I do think that is going to conclude this 100 days of better Minecraft hardcore. But if you guys have enjoyed this video, I'd appreciate if you could drop a like. And also, if you're new around here, make sure to subscribe because we upload quite a lot. And I'm a new channel myself, quite relatively new. And I appreciate every single one of you guys, all of your support you show me on all of my videos. I absolutely love you guys. So I really appreciate every single one of you but like i mentioned if you enjoyed this video drop a like and drop a comment you know tell me what your favorite part was or what you're doing right now trust me i'm interested but anyways i appreciate every single one of you for watching i have been scoops and i'll see you guys on the next one peace out